How's your mamash, Shinshi? It's time to hopefully finish Sekiro. See what happens. Uh, I just gotta... Uh, beating this demon is gonna be something for sure. Umbrella... That's a good idea. Definitely. The big thing is, is... Using my gourds. It's gonna be crucial. Wither gourd and... Not a good amount of dowsing powder. Okay. Overuse. I guess the question is... Kind of... Sugars do I have? I... <clears throat> That's an idea. Not sure I want to use the Yashariku though. It's gotta go for sure, but I want to use the Let's just go ahead and use it. Alright. Thanks. Maybe I should have used the Tonto. Oh, hello, how are you doing? I'm just playing Sekiro. It's the idea at least. Oh, I, oh, never mind. Oh, nice. Right, right. How are you? Okay, I did not mean to do that. I, ooh, all right. And Yashariku is still in there, but I, uh, thank you. Just gonna make sure I don't. Uh, ooh, all right, thanks. Oh, oh, that's frightening. Are you okay now? Yeah, I, don't get hurt, please. And ooh, come on, come on. Okay, okay, just stay safe, all right. And okay, that's good. All right, use that to stay out of the way. And ooh, I okay. Uh, tough fight. My. Oh, I want some caffeine or something, frankly. I, thanks. And using the umbrella is very, very crucial for this fight. And. Ooh, alright. Ooh. I expect the shockwave to get me. But this is the game's extra boss fight. Besides this, I've only got the regular final boss to do. And. Ooh, alright. Just blocking that with the umbrella. And. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Alright. Uh, it's a tough one. Uh, I... I need to use the ceremonial Tonto at the fort. Start to get more spirit emblems. The big thing is... No comment. No comment. Is that... Well, you have to go with the, the classic Cookie Monster pajama pants then. I think that's usually the move. The Tonto here, let's use the palette. Uh, Shriek of Sugar is an okay idea, but uh, it's getting tough. It's not, this is the hardest fight in the game. It was a little bit of column A, a little bit of column B. So this will increase my fire damage resistance, but also need to use some divine confetti. Bit of additional damage. That said, I don't think there was any additional damage from the type of enemy. I think it's just the base damage increase from it being divine confetti. Okay. Come on. Ooh, I need to. Ooh, thanks. And ooh, what? You've got to be kidding me. I might actually be better off with some kind of... Something to actually... Something slower so I can actually... Tell reliably when... Oh my... What? How is... I didn't even see any kind of... Sign... Okay. That was unnecessary too. But... The more... Conservatively I play this, the higher the chance of... Oh my goodness. Couldn't even see anything. Okay, alright. Well, I should stay behind him instead of... Okay. Behind him instead of... To the side of him. But, the big thing is that this guy is... 
basically they transformed the Oni transformation version of the Sculptor, who is one of the main ally characters of the game. Turns into an Oni with the power of hatred after everything that goes on. I could use the fine snow. But this is endgame. It's fun, but we'll see how hard the actual final boss himself is, and I Okay. Let's hide behind the umbrella just in case, because that is the most aggravating thing that Okay. So the head slam attack is easy enough to avoid. The big issue is uh, he fights like a Dark Souls boss rather than a Sekiro boss. Not okay. And oh, okay, you can't actually block that with the umbrella. You have to use. Okay. All right then. You have to jump it. The issue is that I don't see the danger sigil until way too late. And okay. Mm. Umbrella took way too long to come out too. Okay. Stay behind him, I can mostly avoid most of his attacks, but phase one, almost done. Okay. And oh come on, you really Luckily most of its his attacks are very avoidable. Raise to the right, run left. If you raise to the left, run right. Oh! That's cool. Well, I'm glad to hear you're having fun with your cat. And that's phase one done. Thank you. So, I missed the chance to get some special dialogue where Sekiro recognizes this guy as the sculptor. Or the Bushi, the Buddha carver, specifically in Japanese, who is a guy we've been sort of involved in with throughout the game. And. Oh, no damage, but. Come on. And just stay out of the way. And. What are we gonna... If we can... Oh, but getting up against the wall is gonna be irritating. Luckily, we can block that using the... Uh, and move in. Thanks. Okay. That. Cool. One. Ah, you've got to be kidding me. Get behind you. Use the confetti. Alright. Oh. That said, I was quick enough to run away from that, which is good. Thanks. Alright. Oh, okay. I've heard good things about it. I didn't watch the first, but I think the other people in my family did. I don't quite remember. It's been some time. I mean, I know that I haven't watched it. Also, you can get this guy to fall off. Which is funny. I... Uh, okay. I need to use... Another thing of the Withered Red Gourd, which will increase my fire resistance, and then, honestly, probably a Ceremonial Tonto proc. One is the Tonto. It's palette, and cool, and oh, alright. I'm still able to block that, that's good. And, okay. Uh, it's a tough fight. And one, one, and, ah, please. One, two, stay behind you as much as possible. Thanks, we blocked that. One, two, and, okay, what? Oh, you've got to be kidding. Please, okay. And now he's using this attack. And, oh, I ah, ran the wrong way too quickly. Two. Okay. Then we can move in. More fire. One, two, and... Uh, you... Okay. How did that hit me from behind? Makes no sense. This game is actual nonsense sometimes. Yeah, it... Uh, one of the game's hardest challenges, but as you can see, he's got... What... And... More we- Oh, please, you gotta be- What in the goddamn? This game is actually ridiculous. Well, are you gonna do it, or are you gonna not? Get that? Younger, younger, right? It's- What does she even need it for? What, what, what could justify that? It's just- 
I mean, for some kind of special occasion, or literally just, oh no, I forgot my hair gel, please bring me hair gel. Okay. Uh, it's getting rough. Yeah, that... I mean, how old, anyway? It's... It's not, it's, it's nice to, yeah, it's nice to do things for people, but there is an age where you have to learn to start taking advantage, taking responsibility for your own actions. You know, sometimes, if you forget something, it's about forgetting. You gotta live with it. That, well, okay. Alright. I might need to buy more Divine Confetti after this instance. Okay, that said, if I run the other way, I can actually oftentimes avoid that. I, mm, mm. Oh my, okay. Come on. If you want to be nice. Okay. And, uh, run to the side instead of. What? Come on, okay. The side instead of. The hide is gonna be a lot better. Okay. Well. Okay. That's probably a good idea. So this side is gonna be better. Okay. Cool. And. Oh, interesting. Oh, but that got rid of the Divine Confetti buff. It's actually really, really bad. And. Hmm, we should probably use. Bit more of the gourd, but uh, running in is so much trouble. Okay. Oh, and it didn't even connect. Okay. Mmm. Mm, uh, all right. Thanks. And should be fine here. Come on, come on. And oh, really? How did that even? I didn't think that would hit me. Really? Okay. Uh. Aggravating fight, and... Ah, oh, what? I... I could have jumped that. I should have jumped that. That's the big thing. But I... Mm -hmm. Okay. Two, three, one, and... Okay. It's all about that angle, and... Jump! Okay. Uh... What are you gonna do now? Wait, we should definitely get you a bit farther over here, and... I, okay. Oh, nice! You can perfect deflect that. Okay. Well, that's some interesting news. Oh, well, ah, dumb. Alright. And... One, and... Ooh, okay. I... Really? Okay. I didn't know you had an attack like that. Funky. One. And that should be a safe... Interval. One, two, three, four, and now out of the way of you. It's got to stay out of the way of that leg. Two, three, and all right, and okay. Not for a second. That might. Be, oh, please come on. All right. But I. Uh, what am I gonna do? One, two, and okay. Uh, what? Really? Honestly, I wish I had something like an... This makes me wish I had actually invested in the devotion skill. Be able to get more use out of the Buddhist candies. It's actual hell. Huh. This is still generally consider to be well it depends how you fight it probably one of the game's hardest bosses bro is good but uh, honestly using Ungo's that's only physical attacks it should still be useful but not as. Okay. We go. Then. 
Using fire resistance. Okay, cool. Hi, hello, and... Okay. And one, two, three, four. Okay, all right. And yeah, about was far away enough not to get hit. And cool. Take you down decently easily. Okay, nice. That was definitely a bit too close to just avoid it entirely. So that was useful. And better safe than sorry most of the time. So. Alright, and, alright, oh, okay, and this should be the time I need, come on, and, ooh, uh, thanks, okay, two, and, okay, ooh, alright, uh, we're doing okay for ourselves mostly, but, one, two, uh, got all this garbage in here, and, oh, the camera angle's not great, and, okay, you know, did not get what I wanted, but could have, could have, should have just jumped out, but we'll live. Come on, come on, come on, and all right, there we go. That worked just fine. Hey, yeah, cool. That means time for more divine confetti application. That was a decent phase one. If I can just not totally screw this up, I can maybe do this. Just gotta remember to use Yashariku at the last point and go and the honestly at this point may as well use the ministry powder and cool nice and okay we just gotta okay so staying on the right is actually going to be the best way to avoid that garbage thank you and on to I uh, wrong side okay on and oh wow okay well, that was actually pretty good don't need much in the way of that one i can just stay out of the way and uh unnecessary but wasn't an uh what okay cool thanks and jump okay nice the jump actually did it okay i use the ungos anyway Thanks, and there we are. Need to keep running perpendicular to you. Thanks, thanks. Okay, nice. Now we can close on in and just, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, but I'm out of confetti. That's the thing. And one, two, three, four, and all right. Thanks, out of the way, and that goes down. That's when we move in, close in. What are you gonna do? Whoa, alright, and just turtle. Thanks. Okay, cool. Uh, and oh, I heal. Um, and that's oh, right. To work around avoiding that specific. Thanks. Cool. Brow was really useful. But I, uh. Probably gonna want a bit more divine confetti and also just. Oh, come on. You gotta be kidding me. At least running perpendicular works just fine here. Now I need. Again, let's start using this ministry powder. Halfway down through this phase, and. Alright, cool. Just need a bit more to use the malcontent in final phase, and then that's pretty much it. Two, three, and okay. Chase you down, and one, ooh, all right, and cool. And how are we gonna make this work? And okay, ooh, okay, not great. Really? What the hell? Just true combo to death. The worst part is, is that now I need to get, I need to get more divine confetti now. This is... It might not be the hardest fight in the game, but it's generally considered to be the most inconsistent. In that... There's no way to really guarantee a victory. That 
according to other people, you never really feel like you've mastered the fight. Sometimes they just decide to just screw you. Flames of hatred. I just have five billion pellets. It's not much consolation. A lot of it goes sugars too, but it's just. I thought the fight was going well. However, mm, let's use more of this. It's just sometimes, you know, it decides to totally screw you and then you're screwed. That uh, definitely does not make me happy. And alright, cool. One, two, three, four. And alright. On who? Okay. Yeah, that felt like dumb luck. Two, three, and all right, cool. And ooh, but I, okay, kinda. Never mind. Hmm. The issue is how far away they get. And and I bet I could fall off here, couldn't I? Yeah, probably. Feels sometimes like uh, no damage is being dealt. And I, oh, come on. I, well, yeah. Certainly a way to do it. Oh, you're all the way over here. I'm all the way over here. Okay. Actually, I managed to nearly avoid that. Still. Uh, and this side is. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, and come on, we gotta Okay. Okay, we actually managed to run under it, which was good. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, but I oh come on, okay. Just Okay, I Oh, alright. Hmm. Well, getting in close is gonna suck intensely, and there we go, we got phase two in. Decent phase one completion. Let's just use another of my remaining confetti. And then use ooh. Again, we can start using the ministry powder at this point. We may as well. No real reason not to. Thing is, and cool. Alright. So that's my opportunity to step in and grab you, and come on, just. But I. Uh, just gotta jump when I hear that sound, but I. That was nice. I. Mm, but I should probably still. Mm, as smart about that as possible. Three, four, and. You've gotta be. Okay. Fun slam and just avoid the fire attacks. Two, three, and okay. I, uh, I didn't have time to jump it and cool. All right, nice. And the living force is doing its thing right now. The big thing is the closer we get, the more I'll be able to take advantage of the small window I have to attack. And oh, thanks you. You know what you're doing, and okay, let's. Cool. All right, and okay, please. Uh, okay. Oh wow. All right. Great, and uh, please. How am I gonna? Uh, more ministry dowsing powder. The damage of burn isn't all that significant, but I uh, okay. And I uh, okay. 
Thanks. What are you even gonna do? I... Okay. Thanks. Probably use more confetti, but... What am I... It didn't even hit. You've got to be kidding me, frankly. Thanks, and... Oh, well, that... Okay. It's just getting confusing. Hmm. But I, I'm all out of Ungo now, which is... Not fun. Okay. But using that as... Wait! I want to... Killed my confetti buff. That's right. It's intensely stupid. I... I am losing my mind. And the damage dealt by the... Uh, projected force attack wasn't even all that significant. If I didn't need it for a living force, I might have not have wanted to have it at all, frankly. Okay, one, two, three... Or at least something like Kingdom Hearts where we can turn off certain attacks. Okay. Can grapple that, but it's... Okay, come on. All right. Oh, but the terrain got in the way of that? That's actually pretty strange. Okay. One, two, and maybe I should use the Tonto now. That would be okay. Okay, cool. But, mm, now I need... Let's use more Dowsing Powder. And... Malcontent is going to be crucial for phase, fast phase, but one, two, three, and I'm gonna put this guy down and, okay, oh, what, you, ah, uh, really, okay, just, okay, oh my god, one, two, three, four, and it's just, yeah, hmm, plunging attack is really, really troublesome, and, alright, Way of that and just cool. One, two, three. That's as many as I can really afford to go to at any given time. And of course, now you're using the evil Okuda attack. You will get past me, but this is very poor time for that. And cool. All the way, all the way. And just oh, please. Really? Okay. That forces you through that, which is nice, and- Okay! Oh, please, you've got to be kidding. And just- Oh, what? And please, you- Okay. Oh, this is infuriating. I... This is a good enough attempt that I feel as if we need to- And what? Come on, you imbecile. Okay. One, two. One, two, three, four, and what am I gonna want? Thanks. Okay, cool. What in the? Okay, I jump. What? How could I? How couldn't I jump? What? That makes no sense. The most aggravating part of the game is just that. You don't have any kind of mercy and invincibility when you're on the ground or anything. And as a result, it becomes so much easier for enemies to just true combo you with that. It's kind of cool how there is a boss. Yeah. Don't worry. I'm kind of in hell right now. Fighting the game's most difficult and probably most aggravating boss. The Demon of Hatred, which is... Basically... What you would get if you tried to put a Dark Souls boss in Sekiro. And that's a big guy with... Big AoEs on its attacks. And it, uh, as you can see, big issue is that there's no mercy and invincibility for anything in this game. And the big AoEs on the stomps and such are just. It's not a good way to avoid them like there would be in an actual Souls game. So it just. 
it feels bad. It's easily the low light of the entire game for a lot of people. And it definitely does feel that way for myself. The big thing that a lot of people say about it is essentially, unlike any other boss in the game, you never really feel like you've mastered this fight. It's incredibly inconsistent for a number of reasons. The biggest one is just... Has a lot of attacks that are very, very difficult or otherwise annoying to avoid. And jumps around so much. The big thing is that the stomps are very aggravating in a game without any kind of mercy invincibility or any kind of iframe dodge. Yeah, it... People despise this boss for a number of reasons. Uh, Alright. Fuse. Nice thing, though, is that it's fire attack specifically negate using the Umbrella, and also Dowsing Powder and the Red Gourd, which will significantly increase your fire resistance. But it... oh goodness. A lot of its attacks are very, very annoying for a number of reasons. It's just... and... okay. Did not need that, but I... Hmm. Well, this is an entirely optional boss. It's only in one of the endings, and even in that ending, it's a completely optional boss. You don't need to fight this thing by any means. There's no special reward for it, it's just... If you're a masochist, or really, really like the idea of, fight, of beating everything in the game... It... I mean, it's definitely, at least partially, a battle of skill, but... It's different skills than you're employing in pretty much the entire rest of the game. That's part of why it feels so weird and sometimes bad. Yeah, it... It's for crazy people. Like me. But... Hmm. So now let's... Take... Another confetti use. Use... Another... Use of our Withered Red Gourd, another Akko Sugar. Yeah, I... After this, after I hopefully beat this thing, and to be fair, you can kind of quasi-cheese it using Malcontent, which is the Apparition Stunning Ring, but... Hmm. It's not perfect. Okay, well, there we go. The big annoying thing is that as good as the Fire Umbrellas for this fight, it's very easy to accidentally, if you have projected force unlocked like I do, which is the upgrade that gives you the ability for the umbrella to absorb stuff for a special attack. It's very easy to end up uh, getting rid of your own divine confetti buff, which is okay. The nice thing is that that actually, if you're jumping, you're immune to that grab attack, completely immune. And oh, all right, I, okay, cool. I, Okay. Interesting. I thought that being close to him would make all of those miss you. However, that, that is not the case. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Because otherwise that attack takes off more than half your health bar. I appreciate it. It, it is genuinely very pleasant. Okay. And what sucked is that that run was going really, really well, too. Okay. Let's see at a point where we can run in and get a few free hits right at the start of the fight. Get close enough, they'll notice us, and that'll get really annoying. The funny thing is, is that during the start of the fight, on the first time you see him, there were actually a couple of Tokugawa soldiers here, but after he kills them the first time, they don't come back, which makes sense, but two, three, and for three hits is probably not, okay, okay, mm. two, all right, and now you're over there, we can, right, one, uh, or not, or we don't hit anything. One, two, three, and jump. Okay. But the annoying thing is that I can't just grapple onto him from here, because he creates so much distance. 
Okay. And, ooh, I... Oh, please. Gotta be kidding. And, alright. Thank you for the head smash attack. That was definitely not horrible. And, really, really, I... How many attacks can I afford to get in before I have to worry about your stupid stomp? But, uh, the really annoying thing is just how... Uh, come on, just... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Sometimes it doesn't even seem like next to damage. That's how much health he has. Wait, what? Huh? That doesn't even. Wait, what? Okay. Either way, I need more gourd. Hmm. One. And once it goes all the way up, you can mostly run, being able to get in safely, but. Mostly. And one. And really? Just. Okay. Hmm. I. Alright. Three. Uh, thank you, annoying stomp attack. Luckily, he hasn't been doing a lot of double stomps this time around, which is by far the worst thing you can usually do. But. I Jump! Okay. Nice. It actually works. It's impressive. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and oh, please. Okay, all right. And what? It's just there's part of me that honestly feels like going to fight the final boss right now, just to get a tiny additional part amount of additional attack power. Hmm. But. This boss has a horrible reputation. For good reason. Mm -hmm. Big thing is, I need to take it really, really slow and really, really steady. Because. Those stomps are the biggest thing that can get in my way. So I need to find a way to avoid getting hit at all. And it might, it's going to cost more spirit outlets than I might like to spend to pull the umbrella out anytime I see any kind of stomp. There's a good chance it's, it is worth it, though. Okay. A few free hits in. Big thing is that getting behind him as opposed to getting on his right side makes it very, very easy to just miss attacks entirely. But it does make you a lot more vulnerable to the stomps. That's the thing. Nice. Okay. Let's use that to block the big hit and Alright. Thanks. With the fire attack, go through the smoke explosion and... Okay, thanks. One, two, three, four. Uh, uh, one, one, two, three, four, five. And, okay. I, well, I, the big thing is that the umbrella won't do much for me there. And cool. Nice. Right, go over. Walk on it. Uh, gotta be kidding. One, two, three. So three attacks is really the most I can afford to try to go for before. Come on, come on. I, all right. Want or not? We're not even hit, I suppose. And what can I? I well, uh, well, thought I'd do it, but then he went for another annoying little uh, slam attack. Slam that down. Well, we were close enough. Three, four, five. Okay. Cool. Thanks. One in. Slam. One, two, three, four. It's a shame that the aerials are, without exception, pretty much very, very weak. Okay. One and. Thanks. Cool. And. Nice! Okay, cool. Nice. That was a decent phase one. It was okay. Hmm. Big question is, do 
To what extent can I basically get you stuck on this wall area? If you did, you would probably just hit me with a bunch of projectiles and make it the opposite of beneficial to me. Yeah, but we have... This is the best dowsing powder. Best fire damage reduction, so we should try to use that, but... When goes is good. When it reduces... Physical as opposed to fire, but... Question is... What can I... Mm, come on up. Okay. Oh, please. You've got to be kidding me. Heal. And what are you going to do now? Thanks. One, two, three, four, five, and... Just... Okay, thanks. Cool. Move on in. Slam that down. And one, two, and... I just can't afford to... Thanks. Okay. Can't afford to get greedy in any way, shape, or form. What? What happened? And, oh, really? Okay. Cool. And I... Okay. What happens? And... Jump and... Oh! Oh, okay. Sorry to hear that. Okay. Two, three, and just... What are you gonna do now? And... Okay. Interesting. Just don't use your big fire attack, please. I'm begging you. Oh, okay. And what was the joke? Okay, cool. And just... Oh, come on. Okay, alright. Big thing is, I should try my best to lure him over to a spot where I don't need to deal with... Oh, unstompable. That's a funny joke. I like that. Huh. Get over here and... Oh, goodness. Four, five, six, seven, eight, and... Hmm. I jump and... Oh, okay. Actually, the jump did it just fine, but... We should use... Maybe a bit more confetti. Definitely we need... Ministry powder and... Probably an Ungo's, but... We run in close, we can just avoid that entirely. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, and... Okay. Nice, we can block that. One, block, or not. Okay. Well, that block wasn't necessary because it just avoided me somehow. Okay, cool, and... Alright, and jump, and... What? No! Huh? What a stupid way to go out. You see, that's just why this fight is so stupid and inconsistent because sometimes it will just it'll just decide to pull some bullshit like that and you're dead especially on higher difficulty i mean higher new game cycles it's just and guess who needs to buy more divine confetti now <sighs> Not just it's just such a long fight. And it runs away so much. Goku. That's the worst part of it, is that it's just a fundamentally different kind of fight than everything else in the game. Enemies don't generally Try to fly the coop. Like Demon of Hatred does. Okay. It's buying more and more of that. Bon confetti, we have 14 now at least, but. Hmm. Hmm. The interesting thing is that this is. The same location I thought Gobu the first major Boston. Which is a cool detail, undeniably. But um, I just 
Oh, I have complicated feelings about this fight. Once we get past phase two, we can probably cheese. Not cheese, but just get the final phase done by using... Malcontent to keep it stunned. But the thing is that I don't need Gouging Top in there at all. Should keep it out. Weird what? Okay. I you were saying Street Fighter 6. And, okay. One, two, three. It's just the hitboxes on this guy are really, really annoying. And, uh, come on, you. One. And, uh, really that hit me? You're kidding. Okay. Drop it. Okay. Alright. Hmm. Of turtling on other attacks would be a good idea, but it depends. Yes. Come on, two, and go on, run. Thanks. Come on, and all right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and okay. Cool. Nice, two, and just nice, and cool. Oh, what? Oh, okay. And, oh, you're kidding, and I, okay, hmm, all right, let's, thanks, and, cool, decent enough damage on that, but still not as good as the Divine Confetti effect, two, three, four, just gotta try to, out of the way of this, and, and, oh my goodness, I, okay, well, uh, we survived a bit, but I, this is less than perfect. Cool. What? Huh? I. This one is not going to work. I. What an agonizing fight. Yeah, the crackers will help. I just... It's starting to drive me crazy. I... A good amount of Ungo sugars, and I can just buy... Infinite Divine Confetti when I need more, but it's still just... Really, really... Messes me up. And I can't imagine that any kind of grinding for more skills would actually make a difference, except for, I don't know, you know, just spending stuff on more attack power. That's inherently cheesy. Not something I have any intention of doing. Especially since the level of grinding that require is truly ridiculous. But I, wait, what? How did that even hit me? It's nonsense. Okay. That'll keep them out of the way, but uh, just move so quickly and run away so much. I okay. Uh, what? Okay. Okay. I okay. Interesting. Cool. One, two, three, and All right. Sing behind you is a good idea, but it's you can't reach anything that way. And. Jump! Okay, cool. It's decent, but it's just... Making distance is aggravating. Three, four, five, six, seven, and... Alright. Thanks. Cool. The way that... It is! It's because this is the demonic form of the sculptor, the Bushi, the Budo Carver who does not have a left arm because it was cut off by Ishin to prevent him from transforming into an Oni. And this specifically is not a demon form, but an Oni form. I mean, it's not supposed to be pretty. Okay. Come on. Yeah, I mean, the entire deal is he's transformed into an Oni. It's not supposed to be pretty. Literally the exact opposite. This is his failure as an individual. Nice, 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 nice. 
cool. And... Oh, but I... Uh, combo just... Come on. And... Alright. Cool. So the projected force attack actually did more than a little. Yeah. Hmm. Should use just a little more of this. The music's fun too, but it's not as good as the owl fight, in my opinion. The owl fight was really, really good. It was made by... music for that was made by the guy who made the music for... The Tenshu series, which is the, so the series of ninja games that From Software made before Sekiro was a thing. So it has a very different feel, a lot more mystical, I suppose, and cool. It's generally a bit more dramatic, I would say. Deliberately less atmospheric, more climactic. It's a different kind of game, I mean, different kind of music from a different game, kind of game for a different kind of fight. I appreciate it, and... okay. Let's see out of the way, which is nice. Three, four, five, and... thank you. Cool. Great. One, two. Cool. More. Ooh, or not. One, one, two, and... oh, nice! We actually managed to... wait, what? Never mind. I... Uh, okay, cool. And... Heal. I should probably like to use maybe a bit more healing. Presumably I. Uh, big question is what kind of more ministry powder here? And jump! Alright. What else? I've got more confetti. I need a bit more for the final phase, but I can afford to be a little profligate now, presumably, but I. Okay. One, two, and... Thanks. Cool. Alright, and... Hmm, how am I gonna do this then? I... One... And you're gonna slam a little? Okay, cool. As one does. Thanks. One, two, three, four... And, ooh. And we're close. Soon as that proc we need to use Yashiriku and a Malcontent. Well, Tonto and jump! Okay. That was narrow. Let's out of the way and not get killed by your- Oh, well, you're- Of course you're doing that now. Thanks. Three, four, and- Oh my goodness. Okay, great, great. It's great news for me. I- Okay. Cool. And... Could take you down, maybe? Two, three. Nice! Okay. Now we need to use... Ceremonial Tonto. The Divine Confetti, Nashodiku Sugar, and then Spam, Malcontent, Divine Confetti, yeah, it, it was a good hit, and Spam, Malcontent, and, oh, what, okay, just slap, oh my, what in the goddamn, okay, I, and that was my mistake. I was so close to victory, too. Okay, so you don't have time to use three items. You have time to use two, maybe. But I... That was embarrassing. Does that stupid jumper up attack at the start of phase three? And... Yeah. Maybe. Hmm. But. I'm sure you can commiserate with my utter frustration here. It. <sighs> Fair. It's utterly, utterly infuriating. Well, it's still appreciated. Make no mistake. Two, three, four, and... Gotta be patient. One, and... Cool. Oh, what in the... Uh, that's the most annoying attack, frankly. 
a quick sweep and it's so tough to avoid too. Come on. And alright, one, two, three, four. Just jump uh, towards instead of away. That was probably a bit of a mistake. And, oh come on. That's not gonna do it. It's not gonna do it. Taking that fireball hit so early on is it's over. Hmm. It's just I didn't need the ceremonial tanto. I didn't need the ceremonial ceremonial tanto at that phase. I didn't need any more spirit emblems than I had. If I used it anyway and over and because I thought it would be erring on the side of caution, but it wasn't because I just didn't have enough time. I mean, actually, I could have survived if I'd use the umbrella instead, but... <sighs> so much. Just so much. Okay. Good thing is that this has infinite uses. I don't need to worry about running out of that. But... So much going on, and... The stomps, this will work with the stomps, but not much else. And... Come on, come on. One, two, three, but I'm... No, I... Okay. What? Huh? Go to... Kill yourself! Go to hell! Okay. Such a bad place for an enemy to be in. Okay. Stop going over there. One, and... Okay. Cool. I, all right, one, and, okay. But, uh, of course I was able to use the... I... Is that low sweep attack? I guess I'm going to have to actually get behind him. Which will make him nearly impossible to hit. But... He's so weirdly shaped. That it's really, really easy for attacks to just not reach him. Which is the worst thing about this entire fight. That there's just no good angle of no good angle of approach. It's just There's... There are no good options. There's only a least a bad option. Uh, uh, if I hadn't just dumped out, I probably could have won. It's the most annoying thing. Okay. One, two... Okay. Of course, you're just all the way over there. Okay. Just to block that. To, uh, you see? It just couldn't even hit anybody or anything. Two ends. Alright. Just. What are you gonna do now? Thanks. Get out of the way of that. Approaching could have worked if you hadn't done it when it was already really far away. Okay. One, two, three ends. Alright. Go ahead now. Thanks. Two. One. Ah. Uh, really, really? I. Okay, and. That does make it actually decently easy to dodge his attacks, but I. Ah, uh, you've gotta be kidding. Oh, but. Oh, nice. The projected of force attack actually went off successfully. But I, okay, I. Okay, alright. I was able to time that jump because I wasn't too deep in attack swing, which is good, but I. Okay. One, two, three, and one, and what are you gonna do now? Thanks. And, alright. Get you in a position where I can actually hit you. Without having to worry about other garbage. One, ah, uh, please. Uh, just, are you gonna jump up, or are you gonna. What? What are you gonna do? 
Of course you broke lock somehow. That's the worst part. Come on, come on. Just come on. none of those hit? Got to be kidding me. Okay. One and please. One, two. But what's interesting is that he's actually To the extent he's an Oni, he's very specifically sort of orangutan shaped. Because the sculptor, when he was a shinobi, his code name was Orangutan. So, that's why this guy looks kind of like a monkey. Presumably. Okay, and, oh, you gotta be. I cannot afford to overextend myself. I can just sit there. And there we go. A little bit of damage. Healed off that. Cool, and let's just reapply our confetti. That was a decent phase one, but yeah, getting behind him specifically is going to be a better option. Loath as I am to admit it. Okay. Things I can afford to use will be a Yashariku. And a Devon Confetti, even though... Yashariku, Devon Confetti, no fire buff, and then spam Malcontent. Okay, cool. Nice. Let me use our Ungos. Should be okay. Alright. Get him close and try to hit and Okay, I can... No, never mind. That was way too fast. And okay. You're in a good position. Fire spreading on the ground is actually a little deceptive, frankly. One, two, three, four, and uh, what can I do? One, two, and I jump. Okay. You can also do a head stomp sometimes, but it's unreliable. And. Oh, I, oh, come on. You gotta be kidding. One, two, and just run in while that happens. And one, please. One, and, oh, come on. It's just, the camera is my real opponent right now. Okay. Oh, what? How did... How did that hit me? What did that even... That doesn't even make sense. Oh, whatever. Come on. I'm on. Okay. So you stop me, I'll use my... Projected force attack. I'm just... Okay, cool. And... Slip or you will entirely avoid it. Ah, come on. It's just, so many of these attacks just cannot hit anything. Okay, but that didn't work either. Great. Come on now. Oh, what? Okay, cool. Great, and please, and all right. Thanks. Okay. I uh, really, really, Want to make this happen, please? Don't want to die here. This may surprise you. Two and jump. What? Huh? What in the? Okay. Nonsense. Okay. It's not even smoking. Okay. So no special projected force attack for me, I guess. And oh, what in the? God damn you! What? And the funny thing is, of course, it killed me on one of the fire tick spots in the arena. Hi. It's just a horrible experience. It's just, you get lucky or you don't. If you play risky, you'll... If you play conservatively, there's a chance it wears you down before. Just by putting you in a bad position to avoid. You know, because what are you going to do? You know, deliberately avoid attacking almost all the time just to make sure you're always in a space to avoid it? I mean, you're not going to kill it unless you're attacking it. You know, it's got enough posture and enough health that you're going to kill it by depleting its health before you're ever going to kill it by depleting posture. Simply not an option, but... Okay. Thanks. Hi. 
cool. What? What, in the, what did that even hit me? That doesn't even... whatever. Oh. One, two, and... I... okay. Can I... One, and... Alright, one, two, three, four. That was a decent way to get some hits in, but I... I could have just run it for that, couldn't I? Yeah, probably. Oh, whatever. Alright, and... really, really? Please. Gotta be... WHAT?! Honestly, once I beat this fight once, I don't think I'm ever going to do it again. Because it is totally optional. And though you do get a memory to increase attack power from it, you only get additional memories in the first new game cycle, if I recall correctly. So once I've beaten this guy once, I'm going to be doing the bad ending on my own time eventually. Or maybe on stream later, just to get the special skill on the different boss fight. But that locks off this fight, which is going to mean that from that, that point onward, there's really no point in doing it again. Hmm. <laughs> Okay. That is the funniest thing, frankly. Just... Well, you do get two Lapis Lazuli from this, but you only need ten. You can get six per run, therefore four without fighting this guy. So I could get six this run, and then four the next time I do another run of true ending. Or one of the true endings. And I, okay, cool, and all right, one, two, three, get some hits in, but not crazy. Move, ah, gotta be kidding me. One, two, three, and okay, all right, interesting, and I, okay, we did manage to avoid getting hit by the grab at least, but that, uh, oh, really, really, you've got to be kidding, okay. Whatever, okay. Come on. This is probably a bad time of using the gourd, but... Come on. One, two, three, and... Slam, and nice! That was pretty capable damage, actually. Surprised me. Okay. Question is, what's gonna be after this? Uh, okay. Oh, big head slam attack. That was actually quite good for me. Decent to be easy enough to avoid it. Okay, come on up. Alright. Thanks. I oh, please. Gotta be Thanks. And Slam. Okay, nice. Projected force actually worked really well on that. Okay, cool. Huh. I might try relying on that in a woo of divine confetti. Maybe. We'll see. It's the attacks that I can actually get projected force off on are very good to have. Okay. So using the umbrella for offense as well as defense is interesting conceptually. But uh, damage from confetti is good too, but it's not the only option I have. Now we're gonna see. Two ends. Move in. Thanks. As long as you can just barely outspace that, you're in pretty good position. One. Or not hit at all. One. One, two, and thank you. Finally, there's space one. Alright. Actually, I guess saving. Using Divine Confetti a bit. But just not using it excessively. Hmm. This powder's strong, but. Yeah, it's gonna have to be confetti, Yashariku. And then I just start spamming milk and tent. Uh, okay. Hmm. Certainly something. This does it. This does it. Oh, we'll see. Okay. And we did. 
some damage, but uh, okay, cool. One, two, three, four, and please. That's a good attack to punish. Good stuff. And uh, okay, cool. Nice and okay. Uh, oh, please! I did not expect that. Okay, we dodged that, which is good. And thanks. Ooh, all right. We are in a state. One, two, three. Just need to avoid getting stepped on. One, two, three, and just thanks. One and okay. Oh, can I? Oh, okay. That combo is basically the big attack in that phase, so I can. I just gotta worry you out to a spot where I can not get slammed to death. Okay. Hmm. Thousand powder and all right. And really, really okay. Cool, I guess. And what are you gonna do now? Thanks. Okay. One, two, and ah, please. I'm gonna do a big attack because I'm so close to. You're you gonna jump or you're gonna walk? Probably not, frankly. But this is where I wanna be. Run behind and then get close. Okay. Cool and slam. Right and big hit and. Uh -huh. Thanks and cool. Nice. That's smoking, which means projected force attack. Now I can just uh, largely stand in the way of you. Largely cool. One, two, and uh, what am I gonna do? Thanks and slam. Okay, that's just a really, really good attack, but I. Uh, okay. And thank you. Get that out. Some projected force. Cool. So I'm going to block something for you, presumably. Nice! And that's just... It's just a good attack. It's the big thing. Okay. One... Uh, but I... Uh, I... kind of feel like I'd like to... get that in. Cool. Definitely need a bit more in the way. Okay, nice! Thank you. Okay. So only projectiles that block. Projectiles that give the projected force attack. But I can... Okay. One, two, three, four. And a sphinx. Or cool. Swing and alright. Jump. Okay. Uh -huh. And slam that down. Cool. Sphinx and cool. Which means, actually. Well, for one, get rid of the umbrella, we put this on, and then immediately, as soon as we get off, we use our confetti. No, Yashoriku sugar, and start spamming malcontent. And then hopefully we should be able to burst this guy down before any more garbage happens. And, okay, what can I- okay, cool. And- wait, what?! No, you can't actually- wait, what?! That doesn't even make sense. Okay, I... Huh. So no div... Or actually, what I could do is... Apply the Divine Confetti... I was thinking about applying Divine Confetti before going for... Uh, the Death Blow, and that would have been the move. The big thing is that... Phase 3 is so infuriating... Big thing is he does that big fire jump rope attack you saw. That I simply cannot afford to do it legitimately. I have to spam Malcontent. Because he is an apparition, apparently, which means he can stun that way. Well. Hmm. Hmm. Ow. Bit my phone. What other? Hmm. Needed mercury. Grave wax. That scrap. Seven yellow gunpowder. Eight. Oh, that needs twelve scrap off. Okay. Well. Hmm. 
frankly, I want the axe. Okay. Uh, but I can sell off all the almost all the yellow gunpowder. Hmm. We can sell our yellow gunpowder all but seven. Should be fine. I'm not selling my lapis. Okay. But. Okay, I'm not going to scrap magnetite. It should be. Two more things of divine confetti. Okay. That will be enough for one more run. Uh, 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 okay. After this fight, there is nothing else in the game but the actual final boss. This is... Aside from Orphan of Koss, it's becoming Orphan of Koss here for me in terms of just how much this has taken. <laughs> His orphan was in Bloodborne was a really, really tough fight, too. That took a comparable amount of time. Oh, but he saw me. I... I need to make sure I don't pass the threshold. I I can get a few free hits in at the start of the fight. Hmm. Tag a bro who is really going through it. Oh, I think I messed that up by way of canceling out early, maybe? It's possible. Tonto, pellet, then confetti. Remaining confetti. And. Hmm. Red gourd. Well, we're running out of Ministry Powder. That's great. And Ungo! Ungo! And, alright. Cool. Thank you very much. Great. Okay. Two. And, okay. One, two, and just... Get around to the right, and... Okay, that was... A weird attack you don't use all that often. I'm okay with that, though. And just, okay, nice, and one, and one, two, three, four, two at least, and, oh, come on up, okay, all right, swing up, okay, cool, thanks, and, uh, uh, uh. all right then, hmm, okay, one, two, three, and, okay, all right, what an irritating... Worst thing about it is... Oh, please. I, I was just too greedy there. Not, okay. And... Thanks. Take you out. Oh, it's done, too. That's a very good attack to try to... Counter. And... Alright. Oh, but I... Ah, never mind. Moving force is green there, though. The umbrella is... Indispensable to this fight. And, okay, nice. And, but I, I'm stupid. Needed to check to see if you would do one more attack like that. Thanks. Cool. Great, and, uh, mm -hmm. I need survival. Okay. Interesting, interesting. And, let's go on in. Come on down, why don't you? Yeah. Uh, the big thing is that- really? Come on, okay. Use the Tonto, the Pellet, and... Alright then. And... Alright. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Or not. One, one, and just- I can't see what's going on here. It's the worst thing. Two. Yeah, it's just clear that so much damage is being dealt that uh, 
And it's so much HP that sometimes it doesn't even look like damage is being dealt. Not durable. Okay. One. Two and... One, two... Okay, cool. Bit of health back from the death blow. And use... Our confetti. Our remaining confetti. Our... Oh, oh my goodness. Our red gourd and our ingo sugar. And god willing, I can do this with the remaining gourds I have. Thanks, cool. We're good. On one free hit, and alright. And slam. Thank you. Turtle in, and okay. Actually, I didn't need a turtle because we didn't be getting hit. And another quick hit. One, two, three. What are you gonna do next? One. Ooh. Okay. Cool. Heal. And all right. And one. Oh, please. You're kidding. Oh my. Because I couldn't go in straight. That's right. Can I? Okay. What? Huh? I just... What an annoying attack string. The big thing is that I just gotta wait the entire time, but... The delays were aggravating. In the end... I'm over one. I'm nearly out of confetti now. I need to go back and buy more. So off my send pouches. Just buy as much confetti as possible. Hmm. Okay. So all of them. Buy more confetti. This is what desperation looks like, by the way. Okay. <sighs> so, we go back to the outskirts. We have 20 confetti now. That should be at least a couple more ones. At least. Doesn't work. I can always... Kill more enemies. Hmm. Okay. Confetti, confetti, confetti. Thank you. And then we have our gourd, then our ungo sugar, and then we run in. Okay, all right. Okay. Because normally, if you do the kind of pseudo quest line that makes Sekiro recognize this guy, he says, Bushi? As in Buddha Carver or Sculptor when the fight starts. And again, recognizes the guy. Which does not happen otherwise, and there's some slightly different dialogue. The big thing is that you have to give every single piece of single bit of <coughs> alcohol you can to the sculptor and then eavesdrop on him again, but there's nothing to really suggest that, so I did not think to do that, to eavesdrop on him again. Which could have been fun, but well, whatever. I okay. Tough. Well, that's a six of the way down, I guess. And cool, nice. And ooh, all right. And thanks. And boom. Okay, cool. Or, or not. Or thanks. Cool. Okay. One. Then I can. Keep on running around you. Three and just one, two, three. Keep on hitting, keep on hitting, and you're gonna go for a stomp. So yeah, can't afford to go for multiple hits most of the time, which is really annoying. But I'm, uh, of course, I'm stuck in the fire. You've gotta be kidding me. Okay, come on. All right then. Hmm. That was an awfully convenient place. 
you to get stuck. For you, that is. And can I... Oh my goodness. Okay, cool. Oh my, okay. Alright. And, cool. One, and there we go. Okay. That was actually a very good phase one. All things considered. So... Zur Confetti. Zur Gord. So the more I make use of these items, the better this should presumably be. Do have a... It's a good thing that we have a lot of Ungos. But it's still not infinite by any means. To... Come on, just... Oh, oh, but right, I have to actually jump that, and... Thanks, cool. What if I had perfect deflected that? Well, whatever. I can't imagine it would have made too much of a difference. Thanks. One, two... Big thing is that with the confetti buff up, we can't actually make use of the projected force buff without wasting it, so I can... Uh, come on, I... I... Okay. Oh, but that hit anyway. That's cool. And jump! Okay, cool. Rush on in and... Okay, cool. Okay, alright. Oh, but it broke the umbrella. That's the thing. Interesting. Seems like time for more ceremonial Tonto usage. And just one, two, and... Come on in. One, two, three, four. And jump! Okay, cool. What are you gonna do now? You're gonna... Oh, what a horrible time for that. What a really, really bad time for that. And cool. Just move in. Slam! Oh, Nick, okay, nice. Thank you, and... Cool. Slam. Oh, but... Use our timing wrong for that, and... Alright. Thanks. Okay, cool. It actually... I guess it makes sense, because... Not enough things in this game deal fire damage for it to be worth it to make actual fire resistances. Something phenomenological, so to speak. It's just... Sometimes... Yeah, because it's kind of funny that fire actually works on this guy, considering that fire is what he's using, but I don't know. Okay. Come on, just... What am I going to do? Okay. I'm going to use another Tonto and another Gourd Blast use, and oh goodness. I'm going to need that Malcolm Ten. the other phase, and I... Oh, uh, well, that was wasted. Thought I'd be able to absorb a projectile for the sake of some more stuff, but it was not the case. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, and... Okay, jump. Cool. Great, and... Slam! Okay, alright. And... Oh, but it's smoking now. Okay. I... Okay. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, and... Let's actually just... Is there Divine Confetti now? And there we go. So, take that. Then we can use our Yasha Deku Sugar immediately. And then just start spamming Malcontent. Okay. Yeah. Well, it's a different game, I guess. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Thanks. And, okay. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and use that and cool. Out of the way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, I'm all right. And drop it. Okay, cool. And can I? Okay, I need. What is some bro? I also need the gourd. The gourd. The gourd. And you're almost dead. And die. Die. <sighs> it's over. My son, arigato. It's done. The big thing to me is just... The Divine Confetti didn't stay. I think that maybe doing the Death Blow got rid of the Confetti effect. Losing the Confetti, though, was really silly. That was not... That would have been much more comfortable if I'd still had the Confetti, to make a long story short. 
is I still had to take him down normally. Living that jump rope attack was really clutch. Thank you. One armed demon prowled the battlefield. My flint is a deepest resentment, and two more lapis. Okay. Another skill point. I'll take that. Hmm. So the nice thing now is that we can actually go up to Ishin's old watchtower, where we were before. Oh, a lump of grave wax. Oh, that's cool. Hmm. It's sad. Thank you. This is, yeah, it's near where we started the game, basically. But what's interesting is that you can, you basically go backwards through Ashina outskirts after Ashina Castle gets lit on fire in the last act of the game. But you skip over this area entirely, and this is just right outside the castle. But... Hello there. Hi. So a living thing in our demon. Kata ude no oni. One armed oni. Iyo? No. Better that way. I missed that dialogue. Times of hatred suffer eternally. It's a demon. Insa no hono. The flames of hatred. That's all it was. What's its vessel? Ash in the world will become. So I'll step into his place. You have your duties? Nasubekoto. Basically, do what must be done. Okay. Where before? What is this going to be? Oh, a dragon's blood droplet, in case we died a bunch and got a bunch of dragon rot. For better or worse, I always avoid death. And will we get... We have almost enough grave wax for... There's part of me that feels like getting one more thing of grave wax, just to be able to make a lazlite axe, which would be useful on further playthroughs. Okay. Hmm. Let me see. Let's just get out of here. Out of here. We can't go any farther, really, but... Oh, well, we can talk to you. Purchase Battlefield Memorial Mob. Does not have anything special. It'd be funny if he had something special. Now that... Uh, you know, he's locked behind a boss, because normally he was one of the first vendors in the game. Big thing is, and yep, Ashina Castle Gate is right over there. Unfortunately, or fortunately, for better or worse, we just can't go there. It's all... All burned up. That's over there is really is where we fought the Blazing Bull, but that's just... part we can't access now. Actually, wait, is that... Oh, it's a new idol that... Comes in after you being and gate is firmly sealed shot. It's really nothing other than what sounds like something Bennett would say. The memory and there we go. Hatred demon failed to become Shura, vessel for the flames of hatred. Fate would have it bound stubbornly to this world. It wasn't until he became a demon that he was finally able to depart for the next. Oh, okay. Let's see what other. Also, take a look. I did realize that I, a while ago that I accidentally named myself after this. Considering how great Empowered Mortal Draw is, frankly, I could pick a worse namesake. Uh -huh. Huh. Don't need that right now. But this needs Shadow Rush 2. Big thing is that this puts me on the way to unlocking the additional item drop and additional duration for buffs thing. Be nice. Counteract, attack, martial art, and form of prayer, and defeat the enemies of Buddha. That, virtuous deed, improves the amount of sin obtained from enemies, increases item drop rates, deeds of virtue, forgo thoughts of attaining wealth. Sure. 
But it is really funny because... Question of Castle Gate. We can go there now if we really felt like it. Gate Fortress and that... Oh, there's no... Wait. Where's that one again? Can I not get there right now? I thought I got there before. I might be wrong. Hmm. Swollen Gate Path. Just can't reach that point anymore. Nothing there at this point. Hmm. Follow the outskirts. Basically, he burned his way through. So a lot of the fire isn't just the Tokugawa, but his own. So, big thing is, I want to go back to the temple real quick. This is what I might need for some other upgrades, but the only upgrades left to get would be the Lapis Lazuli ones. Hmm. Hello there. And we have good enough Lapis for this, but we would need one more lump of grave wax. Hmm. Had the Adamantite and the Mercury, but... Because this has the effect of a snap seed, which... The only thing that's really good for is killing Corrupted Monk Illusion version more easily. Just because it's easier to fit into a combo, and you can combo that all in. But... This is okay, but it's largely overkill. This is actually generally worse than this version of the Flame Vent. This is cool, but actually deals less space damage than this Sabimaru. Big thing is, is that most enemies who you'd want to poison are going to get poisoned from a single hit of this anyway. At least in New Game Standard. It might change in New Game Plus, but I'm not sure. The big thing is, I think I'm actually going to, right before I fight the final boss, go back to where all the Miss Nobles are in. Well, I can get to... That's basically... That's the final boss one. Which should seem a little familiar, I think. Right over here in the Mibu Manor. Just gonna try to farm one lump of grave wax from some of the fish nobles. Hmm. These guys will actually insta kill you, which is crazy. Let's try to get one lump of grave wax from these guys. Wait, am I. Wait, where. Where did I. Am I in the. I'm in the wrong spot, right? Yeah. They'll do this Vitality Drain attack, which... will allow them to instantly kill you. Which is actually crazy. Okay. Oh, but wait, what? Found? That was weird. The big thing is that... In the original Japanese... They're not sculptors' idols. They're very specifically demonic Buddhas. Pellet? Okay. And the sculptor is known as the Bushi, which is a very specific title for... They're basically the equivalent of something like an orthodox icon carver for Buddhism, in that they don't really seek any kind of artistic novelty. Their entire deal is replicating existing styles of Buddha icon produces worship objects. Which is why I think that the closest... Closest comparison would, again, be something like an orthodox icon carver. Okay. Hello, hello. Thank you. And, oh, we didn't even get anything dropped. It's annoying. Okay. Well, the idea is we go over and... Check these guys out. The big thing is that once you get all of the upgrades, you literally don't need... You don't need upgrade materials for anything else. You know, self-evidently, but it's still funny. The Shuriken and the Axe are good, the Savimaru is overkill and situational, and the Flame Van is 
largely worse than the other version of the flame vent, so... Yeah, give me one lump of grave wax and we will be great. We'll be amazing. Yeah. But it's really, really funny. So what they're doing there is draining my vitality. So why the icon there, literally, it's the kanji for year. So they're basically draining my time. And if the bar fills, well, you don't instantly die, but you may as well. They just make it more embarrassing. And did we... Oh, come on. The big thing is, you become old and feeble. You start using your sword like a cane. And they gain this grab attack where they just run over and get you. It's actually really funny. I just want to see, actually, real quickly. Now that I've got the Lazulite Shuriken, Shuriken, I want to see how much vitality damage that'll deal to them. The way we need Possession Balloon. Oh, they're high. And... Cool, and... Oh, wow. It's actually quite good. Vitality damage is strong, too. Also, they drop a surprisingly high amount of Skill point experience. Hmm. This the big question is, if and when I do new game on my own, new game plus on my own time, will I end up getting enough for to complete the skill tree by then? So once you complete the skill tree, I might have mentioned this before, you can spend five skill points on one more attack power, which I, it's actually a bit like soul stats in that they're pretty heavily diminishing returns. I get the feeling that this guy is... That every time you kill the same enemy, chances of getting a drop decrease before you kill, until you kill another. So I'm just not getting any kind of... Huh. Okay. Hmm. I'll try a few more times, but in the end, it's... Grave Wax isn't needed for too many things. I could honestly just... Oh? Another one with Fat Wax, but... What's interesting is that Fat Wax and Grave Wax are probably cancerous tumors. One benign and one malignant. Because it talks about gross indicating the spread of disease. Hmm. Maybe, maybe the Grave Wax one might be a... Well, I would say teratoma, but teratomas aren't indicated by being dark and as much as they're indicated by just, you know, growing hair and teeth and... Mm -hmm. Honestly, as macabre as it is, it is still a little amusing that... You know, for one of the deadliest diseases, the quote-unquote emperor of all maladies, according... Okay, I thought someone was knocking on my door. Don't think that's the case. Okay. Thank you. And come on. Give me one lump of grave wax. I know you guys drop that stuff. Uh, I'm gonna try one more balloon. If this one doesn't work, I think that I'm gonna have to try to farm them in another spot. It does kind of seem to me as if it might be decreasing my drop chance because I'm killing the same one over and over again. It would make sense. But. Hmm. Okay. Cool. The interesting thing is that when you kill the one that's draining you, all the vitality drain it inflicts on you instantly goes away. Which, it's interesting that they have the ability to tie status elements to specific enemies to such a degree. Mm -hmm. Okay. Guess I want to be really funny, I could just try to get something like Virtuous Atid right now. Well, whatever. Just give me... Oh, finally we got our Lump of Grave Wax. Even in spite of that, I think 
just in case I die anymore, is not actually truly die, I may as well get some more skill level. And that, there we go, we're right at, basically right there. So what that means is, oh, but that's right. I'm gonna get some Sen from this too, so I might as well keep going just to, uh, I've also got, no, we'll sell some things. Go back to the temple then and make the axe upgrade just for posterity. I'm not going to be using it in the final fight. No. Okay. Hmm. I had one joke. I honestly could have gotten a spirit emblem upgrade. Well, since. If I hadn't gotten praying strikes, that would have been two more points, but oh, whatever. I'll live. Mm -hmm. How much? Eight scrap magnetite. Four to sell all but eight pieces of scrap magnetite, then. Okay. Need to sell precisely 11, I think. Mm -hmm. Sell this stuff. No, I need to sell 22. Here we are. Need just enough for the axe upgrade, and... We'll have two left over. Let me just see. How much... Well, this do I have? Oh, one left over, which would mean... Be able to get that. It's funny that the flame vent costs three. And these can both cost two, which is funny, because these two are arguably the better upgrades. This one is good, but it's very situational. It's just beating Corrupted Monk a little early is funny, but... Dispelling Illusions is, frankly, not that important or relevant most of the time. Well, Alright, we can show some of this behavior. There we go. This... Blue should again. Pretty cool. That. Huh. Let's try that Lazarite axe, but. As light axe. Aha! Uh -huh. That's fun. And. Bang and Blade is good too, but. Oh, it really is. The blue really stands out because there aren't a lot of blue things in the game, period. Hmm. Well, it's interesting how they all have more or less different effects, except for the Shuriken. I can mimic certain items. Actually, not items in the Sabimato's case, but for Sabimato's case, that's the only way you can get any kind of poison miss. There's no other way to do that. Big thing is, probably actually going to want to use the Shuriken for this. Maybe. But, if this looks familiar to you, it should. Because this is where we started the game. There we have. All these remnants, secret passage out of Ashina Castle, not far from the Moon of the Tower. Kuro has escaped, and the wolf looks to join him here. He has been used. So it's time to finish this, or at least try. This is generally considered to be a harder fight than the demon, but it's also, I presume, one that can be a bit more consistent. Well, not always. It. The only Souls game that did that was Dark Souls 3, arguably, in the sense that Kiln of the, Kiln of the First Flame is kind of a version of Firelink. Hmm. Okay. Here we are. Uh oh. What's she gonna do? Injured. Hmm. Oh, 
the footing. So another mortal blade. The black mortal blade mentioned that text. Mm. Summon somebody. This is an open gate. Kabori Masino. No one's to bear. Mm. Cursed thing. Oh. Time to take down Genichiro again. Kyohi. Kyohi. And here begins the longest fight of the game. Mairu. Mairu? Mmm. Shimaito Shio. Hmm. But the red mortal boy, the only thing it really has the power to do is mm, get tears from the divine dragon, which nice and oh, okay, so that does hit through block. Okay, interesting. Okay, I okay, I should use. Let's get our Ichimonji back. And can I... Oh, well, never mind. Okay. So this is not a hard fight. At least in comparison. Oh, well. Okay. Oh, wow. That was really embarrassing. He knocked me off the edge. Okay. Huh. Okay. That was a funny way for things to end. The big thing is, is... I'm gonna have to hit him out of his mortal draw. Well, it's just... Yeah, unseen aid on my barely any skill points and barely any money. Thank you, I guess. Okay. Uh, let's do this thing. Another fight with Genichiro. Thanks, I... One, two, three... Ooh, what can I... Uh, one, two, and... Okay, you... This is quite strange, and I can... Ooh, but I need to... Two, and... One, two, and... One... Two... Three... And I can... Slap... Oh, but I... Oh, what? Never mind. Oh, really? Okay. Huh. Okay, d okay. Nice, we got that Mikuri off. It's gonna be slap... Okay. Cool. Gotta do posture damage to you and ooh, but I ah, I should be crushed. No. Uh, okay, I need to. Wow. Okay. Huh. Some strength. Hmm. Interesting. The big thing about it is when he's using his mortal draw. I need to use Ichimonji or something to stun him out of it in lieu of trying to block it. As much like my own, it seems that maybe if I manage to perfectly deflect it, then that timing is going to be tough. If I just normally block it. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Big thing is, I think, I might want to... Well, not during this phase of the fight, but during the other phases. Most likely, try to use Shuriken to keep posture up on the boss and maybe do some gap closing. But... Okay, cool. Slam on you, and just... One, and... Bang! Ooh, I... Uh, very annoying. His timings are tough. Okay. Alright. Uh, one. Two things. And slam. Two down. And that actually worked just fine. And. One. One. And. One, two. Three, four. And. Oh my. Okay. Come on. Oh my goodness. Uh, okay. Hmm. This is certainly tough. And can I slam on you and just one? And can I slam down? Love how 
Benichiro is. Nice. And, oh my, okay. That was a thrust, actually. Okay. Interesting. And can I slam? And, oh, never mind. I One, two, three, four, and, oh my, okay. Can I dodge? And can I dodge? Okay. So actually, step dodging that is more than good enough. But I, one, can I, okay. Slam down on you, and just need to learn how to do this fight. Oh, you can do a floating passage, and oh, well, uh, really missed on that Miki to counter. Can I? One, and up. Uh, oh, never mind, never mind. Uh, okay. Hmm. Okay, and just slam down on you, and one, two, one, two. Thanks. Nice. Okay, good deflect. And half of our gourds are down, and the fight is not even halfway through. Well, the big thing is... Uh, the big thing is, now I can see what will happen. Get excited. Magic of Kuro's blood on the sword. Ooh. It's interesting mentioning Willing Knight because as the game has gone on, it's slowly progressed into night. Oh? You okay there? Check out what happens. Who do you think this is gonna be? So by honor or magical compulsion, it's unclear. It's bound to obey. From the underworld. I will cut you down. So the big thing is... The Japanese, it's a little unclear. It's basically as Ashina returned from the underworld. Yomi, I believe. Well, the big thing is just that it's unclear. When he says Ashina, whether he means... I mean, obviously, there's a... You know, there's a bit of ambiguity of whether it just means, you know, the country of Ashina or the man of Ishin himself. Sad, frankly, I should probably be using. Everything he does is going to be physical. Let's use this Ungo sugar. And can I... Can I... Okay, one, two, three. One, two... Ooh, okay, and just slam down on you and just... One, two, and cannot. Thanks. All right, and can we get? Ooh, my goodness! But he's very much uh, the greatest swordsman in Ashina now. One, I probably should be trying to just mortal draw this. Yeah, there's no reason not to. Okay, cool. One, two, if this works, it works. First slide normally, and then just get magic and, ooh, or not, or not, huh. Power of magic, and just, cool, nice, and, but the time is, uh, come on. One, two, okay, cool. Mm -mm. And the big thing is, now I can... Okay, cool. And actually, I think the way I'm going to have to do this specifically, as silly as it is, is going to be... Using Ichimonji double once... One, and... Oh my... Oh wow, you... Okay. That's funny. Okay. 
Mario Eva, Yaburev. Oh no, oh my goodness. Okay. The degree to which he can just avoid me is crazy. And one. And. Uh, one. Two. And. One. Ah, uh, really? Big thing is, is that it's gonna be all about surviving as best as I can against Genichiro in order to take down Ishin. Thank you. That's one. I'm in a state, that's for sure. She got Tigitexa, because I'll sick it all. And that very specifically is the spear that Gyobu used, because it's, he gave it to Gyobu, he's getting it through supernatural means. And now he's a gun, which is certainly an option. And one, two, thank you, and we are all out of spirit emblems. Great stuff, really. Okay, and just, ooh, all right. Thanks, ooh, I need to, uh, thanks, and one, two, okay. So now we can use her. Mortal Blade, uh, hopefully, and one, two, oh, but I, mm, mm, this is not going to be the way, but I can try to, one, two, and, okay, but I, mm, thanks, two, and, can I spin it, okay, nice, thank you, nice, and, mm, thank you, and, cool, take, take you down, Oh, goodness. I, okay, and what? Okay. I could. I actually got a lot of divine grass. Find snow. Interesting, and. Well, alright. Never mind. But. Mortal Blade is gonna work best for this. Just. Staying out of the way of what he has to do. You know, I could just try to really, really get his patterns down. And that would be cool, too. But I think the easier way to do this is going to be using Mortal Draw. <laughs> Especially for Phase 2. Okay. Fun. So Ichimonji for... Funny Mr. Genichiro. Genichiro Part 3. And then after that... I will use Mortal Draw for the first until I get Ishin down to half health in phase one. And then in phase two, just use Mortal Draw the entire time. And then in phase three, well. That's when he starts using lightning. And then I can actually just kind of choose things by waiting until he uses lightning. And then just using a lightning reversal. To do pretty big damage and just kill him on health. This is not going to be pretty and it's not going to be impressive. But, you know, whatever works. Slam. Slam, thanks. One. One. Ooh, okay, cool. And slam. And, oh, never mind. That was messy. Mm -mm. Cool. And I, okay. One. Two. One, two, on, and, thanks, one, and, slam down on you, but, posture buildup is good, good as it is, is, one, uh, but I, yeah, if it, if it can, if it can be done, you know, the Ashina style is all about results, well, that was actually a really, really bad performance, he went around by Ichimonji, and that was kind of sad, hmm, Honestly, I guess the big question is, might I want to use something like Floating Passage on Genichiro, which would be really funny because it's also his special, his special skill. Well, actually, no, it's not. What his special skill is... <sighs> normal Floating... No, it is Normal Floating Passage. I don't have Spiral Cloud Passage, which is the upgraded version you can get. But... Okay. See how long it takes to do the Ishin fight. We got to phase two on our first try, which pretty nice. It's just this is all about skill. A lot more consistent than something like Demon. 
To be fair, Demon also just doesn't have cheese tactics, which... One, two, yeah, just go in and... One, two, three. One, and... Okay, cool, just... One. One, two, alright, and just... One. One, two. And... Jump, and... Thanks! Take you out. One, two, and jump and oh oh well I, I was I was way too close for that. And slam on you. And we can one, two, three, and one. Okay, cool. And slam that down. We'll use your bow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and can I dodge? Okay. Nice, we actually made that work even though our ton is a bit long. Thank you, just one. Thanks, and... Can I... Okay, dodge. Okay, got... Alright, alright, and... Cool, just... One, two, and... One, two... One, two... Oh my goodness, I, I was so close, too. Uh, it's just... Trying to basically use as few resources as possible during the first... Phase of the fight against Genichiro is good. It is kind of funny because, in a certain sense, you can't kind of compare Sekiro to a Zelda game in the specific sense that in the very last phase, the final Yushin phase, the fact that he starts using lightning makes the fight easier, generally. Which I don't have a problem with. But it is very funny considering how most recent Zelda games is in Breath of the Wild and when you see the difference is that Skyward Sword, which is peak, final boss is just a pure sword fight. But in Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom, both of their you know final phases of the fair final boss fights were very gimmick oriented. And I Thanks, and... Okay, can I... Yep, not... It was tough, and I... Cool. Nice, nice. You just... Thanks, and... One, two, three, four, and... Thanks, and... Can we... Can we... Stop? Oh, no. I, ah. That was the issue, is... I'm letting go of Owl too soon to actually use the combat art, that I'm trying to tap L and R at the same time, that gives a significant chance of using a normal attack because you let up on L too soon. But I'm... Because if I'd used Ichimonji... That would have actually stunned like I'd wanted to. Mm -hmm. So the big question is, could I use something like firecrackers on Ishin? Presume, frankly. Okay, well, did those in the wrong order, so we get, won't get as much healing as we might normally. Oh, okay, that's fine. Hmm. Hello, hello. Slam, slam, do not. Is your mortal draw on me? Hey, oh, but I. Can I. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, nice. Nice. And. One, two. And. Come on. Okay. Slam. Down on you. And. One. Two. Three, four. Slam. And. Oh, my goodness. I, okay. Cool. I can. Thanks, and we can immediately go for the Ichimonji, and thanks, thanks, and one, two, and then we slap. Ah, oh, but I'm just too hesitant there, and ah, oh, that could have been sweet. One, and can we slam on you? Thanks, I one, two, three, and cool. Oh, but I never mind. I want really. Couldn't make the midder deflection work, you've gotta be kidding me. Thanks, and one and cannot slam on you, but 
One. Can I slam down? And nice. Here we are. Get that back. Thank you. Mighty sick it all. Go for our powered mortal drop. Probably use an Ungo Sugar. Final phase is gonna be eel livers. Okay, cool. Hmm, alright. Just gotta bait you into using some attack and can we one and slam? Oh well. Ah, it's good damage, but I was shouldn't cross you got up there was some trouble. And just thank you and cool and oh my never mind. I oh my okay. Cool. Interesting conceptually, but I could could not Thanks, and take you out, and now it's time for just standard Ichimonji doubles. Hmm, okay. I... Whether that's not going down again, presumably I should. Use a pellet and... Thanks. It is going down, but just very, very slowly, and I can... One, oh, but I... Oh, never mind. Never mind, okay, cool. Hmm. Uh, cool. Thanks, and just... Go oh, well, that Mikiri was very, very swift. I can slam it. Okay, cool. Oh, but I never... What? Okay. Oh, okay. This is not supposed to be an easy boss, but... One, two, and just... One. Oh. No wasted movements, but... Okay, nice. Cool. Can I slam down on you and just accumulate monster damage? Big thing is just... Uh, I'm expecting a lot more. Thanks. Thanks. And basically as soon as you see a, see the attack, getting ready, you have to use it. And thanks. And can I... Okay. It's just too fast. Slam. Slam. And nice. Duh. Okay. What? Oh, wow. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, because with... He and Genichiro fight in entirely different ways, which is very, very interesting. Because with Genichiro, he puts these weird, funky delays on most of his attacks, but... Which is probably in part meant to make his fight a little bit easier, because he's not the main event. But it really does throw you off for Yishin. And it definitely does, just from a narrative standpoint, really highlight the contrast between their skill, arguably. If the deal with Genichiro is supposed to basically say, hey, this guy's as much of a threat. Hmm. Okay. It's actually, you know... Continuing to use mortal draws against him pretty much exclusively it might not be such a bad idea. Hmm. Goes around far in the range is very, very useful. Okay. Cool, and just move in. Thanks, and nice. Cool, cool. One. And one, ah, you can, okay, slam, and really, really, I don't like this at all. Jump, okay. This is already going horribly. Ah, uh, okay. Hmm. The big thing is just, I cannot afford to try using Mortal Drawn Genichiro, because there's no way to... You know, basically, if you're out of spirit elements, you can still use Mortal Draw, but a weaker version. But it's not like I can just deliberately say, okay, let's use weak Mortal Draw instead of strong Mortal Draw. There's no way to guarantee that. Also, I'm running out of pellets. <laughs> this could present a problem. I guess the big thing to do would be to actually just not use pellets unless... I absolutely have no other option and focus on using uh, 
Focus on using gourds and actually use pellets as a last resort, even though they arguably are a little worse. Thanks, and just slam on you, but... Thanks, and... Nice, nice. One. One. Oh, but I can... One, two. Thanks, and one. Oh, my goodness. Okay, cool. Not really. Not cool at all. Okay. Thanks, and just... Slam, slam, and... The more posture damage we deal, the better. One, two, and... Okay, cool. And nice, and... Move in. Take you down, and... Nice, and... Nice, and... Ooh, but I... Okay. Do it, tank. Thanks, and... Nice... Ah, oh, can I... Please. Please. And... Nice, nice, and... Mortal Blade, and... Thanks. Tank you out, and this should be... Thanks, thanks. Nice. Cool. Okay. Phase 1 is done. Sick it all. Mm -mm. Powered Mortal Draw. And... Uh, how do I want to do this? I can... Run, and... Cool. Nice. Oh, but... Okay. So I cannot afford to go for... Fully charged mortal draw on him. He will punish that to no end. Okay. Makes sense, but... Hmm. Can I? And... Can I... Cool, and... Oh, that miss? Oh, you're kidding. Thanks. Ah, uh, Ashina Cross is... Noxious. But I can... Heal up a little. Cool. Hmm. How to do this? Hmm. Okay, and one and cool. Ah, but never mind. Cool. Nice. Okay. For the jump hits is going to be crucial, but I ah cannot. Nice, and there we are. One more, presumably, but we're out of Tonto uses, so... Cool! Alright. Means now I can... Alright, and just... Cool. And... Okay. Cool. Ah. Uh, huh. We should use, that's right. This is a... Ill-advised attempt, but... May as well use an Ungo's. Cool. Okay, I, ooh, okay. Time for that is... Window is brutal, and... Okay, that's a sweep. Is it a grab? I honestly cannot tell. And I, okay, well, actually, we can... Uh, probably try to... Slash you down, most likely. Just outrange you. To the degree we can, but... Hmm. It's a cool fight. Hmm. So phase two is going to be aggravating in that case. But saving as many health resources as I can is going to be crucial. Hmm. Okay. Cool. That loading screen is cool because you can see all of these. Ofuda. Sealing the sculptor, basically. Oh, actually, what I should do, frankly, is save every single one of my ceremonial Tanto uses for phase two of Ishin. That would allow me to possibly use them more effectively, get more actual fully empowered mortal draws. Nice, and... Oh, well, that was a really bad way to start the fight. I guess the big thing is, if I jump to the left and forward, I can more or less avoid the... his black mortal blade mortal draw. Honestly, one of the things I'm very excited for about the... Elden Ring DLC is that one of the new weapon types is going to be Odachi, or... Basically, the 
katana version of the greatsword. Which should mean that maybe ideally, they already have a weapon in the base game that has an attack that is basically identical to Mortal Draw. And it's really, really broken too. It used to be even more powerful. It's still great, but it's a bit shorter and a bit more based on speed. I feel like something that deliberately more approximates the Mortal Blade itself could be cool. And just... Thanks, thanks. Thanks, thanks. Thanks, and... Okay. Nice. One, two... Oh, but the range was some trouble. And I could... Okay, cool, and... Alright. Slam that down. But one, two... And one. Come on. And I'm gonna go for your Black Blade Mortal Draw, or... It is nice that he just kind of waits around for us. Very courteous of him. And... Oh, no, he can't. The jump is at least not as possible as I might like. Well, whatever. Thanks. Thanks, and... Oh, but that's a jump and a sweep attack, not a... Thanks. Thanks, and... Cool, and cool. Nice. Slam, slam. But that combo knock is obnoxious. Okay. Ooh, but I... Thanks, and thank you. Take that, and... One, two, and there we are. Cool. I... It's time to use this. Probably an Ungo Sugar, definitely. Switching to Mortal Draw. All right then, great. It might be necessary to form some of these. Okay, and cool, just cannot. Nice, cool. Stay out of the way of you and. Ooh, all right. I uh, focus on blocking rather than. Okay, but only the standard blade itself. Hit not the magic portion. All right. It's better. Thank you. And can I? Uh huh. Thank you and big hit. That was good. And okay, cool. Can I slash? This does good posture. Just focusing on spacing, invading attacks that I can punish. Thank you and cool. And uh. And thanks. Alright. Oh, okay. So actually, both of those space the same way, so it's actually very punishable. Mm hmm. Can I? Cool. And, oh, never mind. And, oh, your reach is actually brutal. Makes sense, but still. Come on, Mr. Ishin. Go for it. And, can I? Cool. And, alright. Can I? Okay. Thanks. Oh, oh, but that didn't even hit. Never mind. Okay. Gotta be. Oh, hesitation is defeat after all. Hmm. Actually, though, probably. Probably get two hits off. Yeah, yeah. And can I. Can I. One or not? Okay, cool. And. Okay, thanks. Maybe, maybe not. Okay. But, uh, oh, never mind, never, never mind. Oh, please, uh, thanks. Okay, cool. One, uh, really? Okay. Too greedy here, but I gotta wait for a time when I can. Uh, one, two, and really, really? Please. Now, the lack of range on normal mortal draw is really, really tough. One, two, and. Magic damage dealt is very, very useful, but I can one, two, and prevent punishment follow up. Thank you. Hmm. Okay, I. Ah. Uh, can I? One, two, and. Okay. Hmm. And. Oh my. Form is just too good. I should probably focus on trying to. Ah, uh, thanks and 
swing and really, really okay. Die. This phase one down, but I'm in a state. Okay. And I really can't afford to use the Tato, huh? Well, let's get a free hit in and okay. Cool. And alright. Thanks. And wow, okay. I really need to focus on okay. Hmm. Nice. Nice. Oh, okay. Huh. Maybe I don't need to try using the Mortal Blade for this. Uh, just... Maybe the only thing I can do is literally just parry him well. It's entirely possible. Big thing is that his long range dragon flash attack would be really, really good bait in the sense of it's a perfect opportunity to just lay into him. Except, no. And he also just doesn't really do it. Hmm. Huh. So the big question is what I'd even be using. Well, maybe what I do is that I get really, really good at. Genichiro, and then his Ishin's first phase, and then use Mortal Draw for the second phase. I think it's a funny way to prevent follow-ups. Okay, cool. And never mind. That's not gonna do it. So basically, if I see him crap Black Mortal Draw, I have to interrupt it as quickly as possible, but... Hesitation is defeat, after all. <laughs> oh, all right. You know, because in theory, if I really wanted to, I actually could kind of cheese this. It would take literally forever, but I could just grind up to 99 attack power now. It would be a really dumb idea, but I could do it. There would be zero point in it, but I could do it. Okay. Hmm. Come on, Mr. Genichiro. Thanks, and bring that down on your head. Nice, and thanks. Cool. Oh, but I... So that one is actually quite fast, but... Hmm. Thanks. But I... Bring that down on you. And thanks, thanks. Nice, and thanks, thanks, and oh, please, uh, okay, cool. This is, thanks, and no. Oh, you staying still is actually really funny, all things considered, but no. Slam on you, wind up, that, oh, but uh, okay, cool, and move in, slam on your head. Thanks, and cool, cool. And one, two, and just... What are you gonna do? Will you... Oh, come on. All right. Dodge. Oh, ah, please. Oh. All right, that was the grab attack, not the thrust attack. Okay. Okay. Ugh, but just... Of course. Of course you can. You might not get an immediate response, but I'll do my best. And the big thing about this is just... The timing is on every attack. In the end, phase one each in shouldn't be horrible, horrible. Just need to... Hmm. Take him down with, I don't know. If I focus on actually getting in and parrying him, maybe even counterattacking, I could, one, two, there we go. Thanks, thanks. That's the big thing, is that I can't tell as easily as I would like, you know, whether he's going to be using his floating passage or the big delayed swing. 
Hmm. That's the real trouble. Passage is kind of a two, 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 three. Actually, two, 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 one. Well, a print? What do you mean by a print? I think. I think I need to know what her new hobby is before I can understand what you mean by that. Okay. Because Shinobi's Karma, Sculptor's Karma, got one of the Spirit Animal upgrades. Hmm. Okay, cool. One, two. One, and. One, two, three. Ah, uh, but I. Okay. One, and. One. One, and. Can I slam that down on you? One, two, and. Cool. Oh, wow, I. Okay. Oh, oh, embroidery. So they're embroidery prints. Okay. That's cool. Huh. I. Yeah, yeah, okay. I know what you're talking about. Magic pen? What is that? So does it kind of, you just hold it down and it threads it for you so you don't have to possibly stick yourself? Is that it? Okay, okay. Fair. I don't know. She could, she could join an underground flight club or something, I don't know. Mm, but, this is gonna be something. Okay, yeah. So you don't end up, so you don't have to worry about getting yourself stuck. Okay, I see, that makes sense, yeah. Thanks, thanks, and nice. Cool, and, what can I, jump and, oh, never mind, okay. Thanks, and there we go. Oh, okay, interesting. I, thanks, one, and, cool, nice, and, didn't even think about the idea of putting your back with embroidery. Interesting, I, one, two, one, two, two, and just, thanks, one, two, and, cool, cool, nice, and move in and slam on you. We actually got... Better at this fight. One, and thanks. Jump and slam on you. There we are. That was great. Well, I thought it'd be because it would hurt her back. One, one, and can I? Uh, uh, thanks, and. Oh, please. She is. One, two. One, two. Oh, okay, so right. Do an Ichimonji double. Yeah. Was a good hit. One, two, three. And can I. Okay. One. Okay. Slam down on you and just. Ooh, well, ah, I should have Mikuri that. One, ah, please. One, two, and can I? One, ah, never mind. I, hmm. Figure out how to do this first phase. Huh. Okay, and. One, two. Slam on you, and. One, ah, two, three, ah. So casual with his swings. Just. Go for the Mikiri and one, two. One, two. Oh, I, ah. I'm trying to block that instead of one, ah. Let's see, punishes my healing. How can I, one, and, ah. Thanks. Thanks, slam on you. And oh, but I saw that. I literally saw that. I, what? Never mind. Okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. Can't get hits in on you like I'd like to. Once. Ah, but I, as soon as I see the flash, I guess. 
So you can after I see him flash and but I ah come on. Come on through and come on just that would have been perfect to make it eh? One, two, three. Okay. One, two, three. Alright. Okay. One. Thanks. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. And thank you. Take that. And thanks. Use the little opportunities I actually have to counterattack. And thanks. Thanks. And nice. Oh, I definitely can't do any of that. Huh? Alright. Thanks. Alright. And immediately Ichimon do double you. And one. Ah. It's actually pretty good. So basically, the hardest phase of this fight is going to be phase one. Because I need to take phase one down and just normally, quote unquote. With pure sword play. Which is going to take some stuff. It's going to be some trouble, but. <sighs> big thing is. is it's fun, but it is the longest fight in the game. It's probably the only Souls game, and even just ignoring the DLC, because there is downloadable content that adds a few bonus bosses. But it doesn't add any new areas, and you also just need to beat the normal game first entirely, even to unlock it. Big thing is, though, that. Come on. And. Slam on you. Nice. What? Ah, uh, but I. Okay. Ah, uh, that was really, really unfortunate. Okay. Big thing is, most Souls games, well, I guess at this point, most people, counting Dark Souls 1 is, I guess most people would count the DLC as part of the base Dark, Dark Souls 1 because of how long it's been, but the big thing is that, well, I guess you could probably count Bed of Chaos, frankly, because it's so obnoxious, but, oh, no, no, it's definitely Four Kings. In most Souls games, the most difficult boss is not the actual final boss of the storyline. And to be fair, Ishin is the final boss of, you know, the good endings, though to be fair, there is a final boss if you don't f choose not to fight out. If you obey the Iron Quote and try to hand over, hand over Kuro, but uh, I was too slow. The big thing is, most Souls games have some kind of bonus boss that is in some way arguably harder than the game's normal final boss. Four Kings is needed for DS1, but most people would still consider, consider it harder than Gwen, especially on New Game Plus. It's because of the mechanics of the fight and how they can spawn in more over time and then gang up on you. But in Dark Souls 2, you have Dark Lurker. And in Dark Souls, especially since Nisandre was kind of a pushover to begin with, Dark Souls 3, you have Nameless King. Even without D DLC, because Soul of Cinder is frankly kind of a pushover. And in Bloodborne, you've got... I guess, well... I wouldn't even really say Queen Yarnum. The big thing is that Garmin and Moon Presence are actually kind of easy, honestly. I was distracted by my own talking. But. And in Elden Ring, you've got. Got Millennia. That might even be the best example. But in Sekiro. Most people would say that Sword Saint Ishin is the hardest single boss. It's got four phases. Four phases. Okay. 
Calling typing talking is one thing. Calling talking typing another is insane. No comment. No offense. But... Because this is the only four-phase fight in the entire game. And there is nothing like it. It's entirely unique. Well, oh, but I... Variable speed is vile. Okay. Thanks. Slam on you. Oh. Did I? Well, that tells you how distracted I am, then. Okay. Thanks, thank you. And... Cool, cool. One, and... Can I... Mm, can I... Slam on you. And... One, two... Thanks, and... Oh, well, I... Oh. Super attack is... Oh my goodness! This is actually really, really bad. It's just... The fact that that Mikiri Leaping Thrust was used as a heal punish meant that I simply could not use it for anything. The big thing is honestly going to be finding a way to... Okay. Or not. We can let sleeping dogs lie. Or even tell the truth. But... The big thing for me is... Ishin, his blocking is consistent enough that I'm not really going to be able to actually get much any health damage on him. Which is going to become troublesome, probably. Because it means I'm going to have to be really aggressive in order to actually get who he has down. But one, two. Thanks. And one. Ah, but. One, two, three, four. One, and one, but I- Okay, cool. What? What? Huh? Never mind. The big thing is that... The follow-up timing for the follow-up deflection, and deflect his big slow sling swing. The follow-up swing isn't just fast, but it feels like the deflect window is kind of weird. That's a lot earlier than you would expect, but you can block as it hits you. But if you block... As you would for other attacks, it just will not go. Hmm. But... The fact that... The fact that it's four phases is probably the most intimidating part of it, because it means that if you rely on tools, you're probably going to run out of emblems. And just one, two, three, ah, but one, two, one, two, three, one, two. Thanks, thanks. Okay, cool. Let me hit you. One, and... Thanks. Thanks. Go ahead for your floating passage, I dare you. And slam on you. So you're so much faster than your grandfather. I mean, your grandfather is so much faster than you. One, two. One, two, and one. Oh, uh, what? Bow shot was vile. So the big thing is, I shouldn't try going for deflections on the arrows. Should focus on just blocking the arrows. Hmm. So they can be deflected, but it's just not worth it. Well, to be fair. The entire reason Ishin is so strong is the final boss here. Is that... When he gets re-summoned re effectively from the underworld... He... He isn't really much younger. If he even is younger, but he's not sick. Throughout the game, he has some unspecified illness that... 
makes him a bit weaker and slower. So I can't wield the spear. But, nice and cool. Oh my goodness. We were close. Thanks. You and one. One, two. And nice. Okay, cool. Oh, you can step dodge that, I think. Alright. One, two, three. And thanks. One, two. Chunks of HP. And one. One, two, three, four. And alright. And cool. Chunk HP. And well, we didn't get HP, but that was fine. Alright. One. And what are you gonna do now? I can slam down on your head and one. One, two, three, and, all right, and, move in for a slam, and take you out. Cool. I think I'm getting a little better at Genichiro, ideally. I do sick it all. Using Ungos. Need that physical defense. Okay. Thanks, 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 and... Slam on you. Oh, but I'm. That's the thing, is that he's so big that I can't actually reliably guarantee a hit on him. Okay, and. Mid air combat out on you, and. One, two, and. Can I. Okay. Thanks. And. Can I. One, two. And. Thanks! Alright, nice. And. Slam down. One, two, Three and thanks and oh wow okay I oh actually that did not instantly kill me but actually I uh, issue with this is I think what I'm gonna have to do is actually try to use thanks you should have can to maintain his posture prevent it from going down. When, thanks, thanks. Oh, but... Thank you, and slam down on that. Those are actually decent to counter. Oh, but how did that not hit? I mean, how did that not counter? But, uh, thanks. Uh, one, two, three. Hmm, okay. One, and... One, uh, Literally right when I see the flash. That's the only time I can afford to try. That's when I need to deflect it. One. Ah. Timing on that is just so unforgiving. One, two, three. And you are. One, two. Slam down. And. Thanks. And. Mayoeba Yaburero. One, two, three, uh, oh wow, okay. But uh, uh, wow. But the big thing is, maybe I need to use an Akko Sugar or something, maybe even a Yashariku, just to take down phase one as fast as possible. Just because without Mortal Draw, I don't have anything resembling a good way to actually deplete his po deplete his health rather than his posture. And if I can't chunk any of his health, he becomes difficult. Either way, final phase is going to be a process of literally running away from him until just running away from him until he starts using lightning yes. lightning based attacks and then using lightning reversal to get it back on him one two one ah that was tough it's the start of his floating passage it's very very similar to big slow swing and that if I was smarter I could tell the difference but I am not that smart right now
Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. All right. Okay. Cool. It's a really cool fight, though. I like it a lot, but it's just there is nothing to do other than just familiarize myself with the pattern. Okay. Yeah. If it's the heat, probably. One, two, three, four, and can I chalk a bit more health and posture? Nice. One, two, three, four, and all right, and it's cool. Oh wow, we did not space that correctly at all. Thanks. One, two, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, wow, okay. Nice. Uh, okay, we got that. Nice. Slam down on you, and one, and up. Slam, slam, and one, two, three, four, and thanks, thanks, and all right. So two step dodges will do it. Thank you. Okay, cool. I want to see... And Akko Sugar might make this work. Or not. Let's, this is the one Akko Sugar I have, period. Okay. One. And, ah, alright. Thanks. One. One, two. Don't, thank you. And, oh, well, okay. That timing is different. Not in a good way. One, two. And it's just... Thanks. All right. And that really, really makes a difference. That one, two, and thanks. All right. And cool. All right. And just one, two, three. Thanks. And dodge it. Okay. One, two. Chucked a bit of health and posture. And can I... Oh, oh, okay. Hmm. That's the thing, is that I haven't attacked him in it. Means his posture is going back down. And one, two, and slam on you. I maybe using the Akko Spirit Falls could be good, but ah, kidding. What a crazy, crazy fight. Akko's is good. I might actually try using something like the Ashadiku Spirit Fall. That could work. Hmm. Hmm. As we are completely out of Akko Sugars, which means the Spirit Emblem versions are going to be necessary now. We have a good amount of Spirit Emblems, but not an infinite amount, and I have fewer than I did a little while ago. Hmm. But... Certainly something. Certainly something. Focusing on blocking and... Hmm. Devotion honestly would be good for these fights. As in the skill that lets you get more use out of the candy buffs. Well, ah, uh, but no, whatever. Okay. I... I... Honestly... The Akko stuff is so good. I'm just gonna use my Spirit Emblems for that. Getting the Akko's buffs to try to... Well, Akko's buff on Genichiro. Yashoviku buff on Ishin Phase 1, probably back to Akko for Phase 2 because I just can't afford to have, have health in Phase 2, most likely. Okay. Use the Akko Spirit Fall. There we are. Okay, cool. Cool. Thanks. Should still have our effect. Nice. And... One, two... One, two, one, ah, but 
Tommy is so unforgiving. Uh, one, two. Can I slap? Uh, no. What? Can I? One, two, and. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and. Okay, uh, no! Okay. The Arcos was good, but I was just too. too aggressive. Hmm. Okay. Okay. It goes with a mortal draw or something. And phase two could be useful, but who knows? Maybe I just start honestly using Yashariku right when it starts. But the issue is that the more I use, the fewer emblems I'll have to actually just use mortal draw. And Second phase comes around, unless, I guess, I might end up, honestly, just learning phase two. Deflecting that, and then I get to phase three, and I just run around deflecting lightning. It's an idea. Oh, that costs more spirit emblems. I mean, it makes sense. It's a bigger buff, even with the issue. Okay. Cool. Thanks. One, two, and... One. I'm gonna slam down on you, and... One, two. Come on. Oh, but I... Okay. One, two. One. This one, two. Bang. Oh, well, I... Oh, okay. It was a good idea. Actually, a really good idea. Especially just because... We deal bigger posture hits when we deflect with the Ashadiku up. It doesn't just increase the damage we do to health and the posture by hits. But. It effectively increases the offensive power, quote unquote, of our deflections, because those scale off of our attack power. But. Hmm. And the big thing is honestly just that, given the way posture mechanics work, a 25% posture damage buff is a lot more, a lot more impactful than you might think, because this is Yasha. Well, what's interesting is that Yasha. That's just Yaksha. I'm basically using Zhao. One, two. One, and can I slam down on you? Thanks. I did too aggressive, but one, and can I slam again? And one, one, two, and oh my, wow, okay. So that's really strong, of course, but. Sunochikara. You know, two arrows will kill me. That's not as good. Hmm. But Yasha is just that Yaksha. Okay. This is fun, and I am, you know, learning. The fight, the towels, the big issues that to get to phase two, and we're in phase two. I need to beat phase one. Hmm. There's no way to cheese things. Not that I really want cheese, but it's just you can buff your attack, but besides that, it's just you use it. Oh, but. You know, I can't, you can use that infinitely as long as you have the spirit emblems. Okay, good. And cool. Slam and... Okay, so the double actually worked. Wasn't expecting it to, but okay, cool. And, alright, thanks. Can I slam down and slam? I, this is still bad. Okay. Big thing is, you pretty much always... Goes for Black Mortal Blade, Mortal Draw at the start of the fight. So I can actually charge up the Ichimonji fully, which should help even more. But. 
it's a really, really cool fight, but, you know, there's so much I can do. Okay. Big thing is that I feel as if resurrecting at least once is going to be necessary to actually win this fight, which I usually don't do because it, you know, well, to be fair, there's no reason not to, given that the only thing we'll have to be Dragon Rod and losing skill points that I don't really need at the moment. Okay, cool. And slam. Slam down. And one, two. One. Ah, oh, but our timing was really bad. Nice! And we got killed in midair, too. Okay, cool. But. Yashariku's is really, really good, but you have to know what you're doing. Huh. And it also does seem as if I might honestly need to go for just pure deflect-oriented tactics on phase two as well, even though he gets the big spear. That said, when he gets the spear out, he does have a very predictable Mikide counter counterable attack, but that lightning is going to be... Uh, crucial to figure out how to reliably reflect is the thing. So I do that, you know, I'll be safer, but... Okay, cool. Thanks, one, two, and... Chuck your posture, and... One, ah, but... Timing on that is... What? I was deflecting! I mean, I was blocking, and... You can block... You can block arrows too, not just deflect them. I'm gonna try Yasha Deku one more time. I might have to go for just standard Ako. Hmm. The big thing is, is that it's probably the only thing I can really reliably use candy is for in the spine. I mean, emblems. The real thing, honestly, is that... It might be a good idea to use the Shuriken if Ethan Ishin ever stays at range to just... Pester him and prevent his posture from going back down. Just in case. Okay, I... That was badly, badly done, but... Just see. Thanks, and just... Thank you. Okay. Slam down again, and big. Posture damage. It. Nice, and... Oh, but I... The timing on that was actually two. Hmm. One, two. One, and... One, two, and... Alright, and thanks, and... We got down on you, and... One, one, and... Thank you. One, two, and... One, two. And can I slam that down on you? And we're close. Thanks, two, and... All right, all right, and cool. Bring that down on you, and there we go. Cool. Thanks. Okay, cool. Maire Sekiro. Use our... Alco Spirit Fall. Thanks. Okay. One, two, and send that down, and Arcos is good, but I can... One, two, and... Yeah, oh, but I... Uh, Ichimonji was badly used there, but I can... Thanks, and... One, two, three, uh, and... All right, and can I send that down on you and recover? Posture. No, he blocked it. He actually deflected that. Wow. I... Huh. Oh, Hajime Mashitenshi, how are you doing? I am... Fighting an old man who is really, really good with a katana. It is truly... Truly the death of me. How are you doing? He has introduced me to a new world of pain. Your, your Misha? Your Misha? What is that? Okay. Uh -huh. We're doing okay for ourselves, and... 
using some decent attack buffs. Oh, Misha from Star Rail. Okay, right, right. He's the, he's the little guy, right? Is that right? I'm not too familiar. So Yashideku Spirit Ball should be good here. Oh, is in. Oh, is in building. I thought you meant like a model figure. Okay. Well, that's nice. And just up and we're right down on your head and just one, two and ah, but the. Timing is really troublesome, but I... Hmm. Go ahead and... One, two, thanks. One, two, and... Oh, come on, come on. Thanks. Thanks down on your head and take it up. One. And... One, jump it. Oh, oh, what? No, I... Ah, oh, I dodged instead of jumping. So, what's... What's his path in his element again? What's his playstyle? Presumably he's some kind of damage dealer based on the fact you're bragging about his damage. Oh, wow! And were you... Who were you rolling for? Clarind or... I'll hive him. Presumably I'll hive him. Okay. And let's keep on going. This... Oh, oh, oh nice, you won. So you were going for Clarind? You could always go for more all Hatham cons. Oh, oh, interesting. So, well, maybe not in Star Rail, to be fair. I think turn-based dim. Oh, so you're. Well, then why weren't you waiting to roll in the Furina banner? Gambling addiction. But. Uh... Keep on going and come on, charge it up and slam on you and cool. Oh yeah, I would not risk it either. That you're you're playing with fate. I the thing about Savos is uh, we might have talked about this before, but they nuked. They basically just nuked his kit for no real reason. In that a lot of his cons are based around buffing his charge attacks. But you can't actually really take advantage of his low field time requirement with a quick swap team. Because even, you know, we could put him with Tinari maybe. That could be a fun idea. They could quick swap, you know, in and out to just keep the damage up going. And then sending some, like, Kira and Fischl back in to keep things going. But the issue with that is it's just... Sethos's special charge attack buff has a cooldown equivalent to his burst. So, if you want to actually use Sethos with any level of effectiveness, and, be, you know, as you might expect, it's not really that much effectiveness to begin with, you need to be using his burst anyway. Oh, okay. As in a real person, or... an idealized person. Nice, and thanks, and cool. Come on, come on, ooh, I, one, and, can I, send that down, oh, okay, okay, one, and, cool, nice, and, all right, cool, and, take it, ah, uh, one, and, one, two, there we go, that was actually really, really good, didn't take a single actual hit, so now I think we should use the Akko, uh, Let's use the Akko Spirit Ball. Then just... Take down... You should... Come on! Ooh! I... Okay. Alright. Huh. Flash. And what? Oh! No! No! Okay. Fair enough. Have fun. One, two, three. And... Uh, sleep well, Santa Wagon. One, two... And... Thanks. All right, and you. Ah, ah. One, two, and I just. Ah, it's tough. I slam and one, two, three, and okay. I need to. Ah, uh, uh, I needed to dodge that a different way. This is a very tough phase, and it might end up being necessary to grind more spirit emblems. Okay. It's getting close. Need to fight you. One, two, and 
There we go, the ocean across there was good to dodge. It, ooh, I, hmm, but, can I, ah, was, how did he dodge out of the way of the, he step dodged my Ichimonji? Really? How do you get to do that? What kind of privilege you have as a funnel boss? And thanks, all right, and one, two, just get you one, two, and can I? One, two, and oh, just can I? Thanks, and what? All right, all right. One, two, three, and thanks. All right, and slam on you, but just one, two, and one, two, and thanks. All right, and just. Slam down. Oh, but I'm. Ah, oh, really? Come on. It. It's interesting, but. This is the greatest swordsmanship challenge in the game. Really, nothing else here. Pain, death, suffering. We did pretty well, but honestly, I. The big thing is that the speed of that three-hit combo is very, very weird in that it's sort of fast, slightly slower, still not slow, but then fast again, it's quite tough, uh, but keeping up with the Yashoriku is... I think that just in the interest of not using too many, too many albums, honestly, I might go with Akos anyway. It's not a crazy difference, but it is still a buff. Cool. And one, two, and one, two, one, and can I slam down on your head? And one, one, two, three. Not one, two, and one, two, three, four, and can I? Oh, one, two, one, two. Oh, but I okay. And move in, slam on your head. Thanks. I one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and dodge. dodge. Okay, can I slam on you? And there we go. That was a pretty good Genichiro fight. Okay, let's use Akos. If you use anything, this is... It's interesting for sure, but... One. One. Thanks. Alright, and... Slam, slam. And one. Two. Thanks, and... Ooh, I messed up that timing really badly. Okay, cool. And, okay, thanks. One, two, and, uh... One, two, three. Thanks, and, okay, never mind. I, okay. Can I, ah, uh, but... Timing on Ichimonji is vile. So that quick thrust is the kind of thing you really want to... Mikiri, the big thing is, is... If I can... Block his hits, deflect his hits, without having to... <sighs> the big thing is honestly just, I cannot afford to step away to heal. Because that is going to lead to him just closing the distance, I mean, creating distance, healing off all the posture damage I deal to him. Oh. Unsteppable. Yeah, literally, because the Mikiri counter is stepping on his sword. He's unsteppable. Yeah. I like that you brought that back. It's funny. Okay. This is the Akos. Okay. Cool. And slam, slam on you. And just one, one, two, three. And what are we gonna? 
Okay. One, two. One, two. Three, and... Oh, well, I... Uh, come on. One, two. One, two, and... Alright, and... Well, never mind. I need to plug in my... Plug in some stuff, too. Oh, but, I, well, I did, I meant to resurrect. Shouldn't matter. Okay, whatever. And what happens? All right, we lost one of our two sen. Great. <laughs> that makes so much of a difference. <sighs> All right, all right then, all right. At least, cast a couple of spirit emblems per attempt. Gotta make sure they're not using anything that requires it. This permanently goes away. Thanks, and cool. One, and one, and it's gonna slam on your head. Thanks, and one, two. Thanks, and one. Thanks, and can I? One, two. One, two, and all right. Two back is good. Slam, slam, and one, two, and jump, and one, two. We did that effectively, and just are we gonna slam on your head, and just one, two, three, four, five, and the spamming that floating passage jump is good. That was good. We were burning this fight. It's that phase of this four phase fight. Okay, cool. Just. And. One, two. Can I. Ah, but I. Nice. Cool. Ah, never mind. Okay. I. Okay. Nice and. Ah. Uh, need to make. Probably need to use this again. Okay. Uh -huh. Get in close. Thanks, and two. Slam on you for a bit of extra. Thanks, and oh, never mind. What in the. One, two. Thanks, and. How am I gonna do this? I, okay. I honestly might try to use Yashariku and see how it works here. Hmm, okay. Go in, and. Nice. One. And. Can I? One, two, and. Alright, thanks, and. One, two, and. Ah, oh, never mind, I. Okay. How am I gonna. One, two, three. No. One, two. Nice, and. Okay, cool. Can I? One, two, and. Okay. Ah. So, Yashuriku could be a good idea. The big thing is, I need to. For phase one of each, and phase two of the whole fight, the big issue with that is I need to. I need to hope he goes for an Ashina Cross at the start. If I can deflect his Ashina Cross successfully, which is just press deflect twice rapidly when. Goes for. First hit. I mean, deflect twice rapidly as soon as I see, see the flash in the scabbard. I can get a good amount of posture off of him, but after that, I'm gonna be in a state. Because it would be Akos, then Yashariku, and then. Hmm. Alright. I, I'll be alive. I'll live. Maybe. Probably not. But. Yashariku on. Kenichiro, Yashariku on. In phase one, just everyone who I can afford to be a little less cautious with to one. Ah, oh, but I. Never mind. Slap. Down again. Thanks. One, two. One. And. Cool. Thanks. And slam you out of your combo. And. 
One. And uh, one. One, two. Thank you. Goodbye. Okay, cool. All right, then. Should probably renew our spirit fall. Thank you, and just ensure that nothing else happens here. Go for your Ashen across. Way to start off the fight. Thanks, and two. Hesitation is defeat, right? So they say one, two, one, two, and thanks, and why? Ooh, well, never mind. Okay. Huh, huh, okay. That was a good idea, but... Big issue is that I totally misread the... Big wind attack. Honestly, I... Uh, I had dodged the side, I could've... Gone for a really good punish, but... Uh, if I really wanted to, I could be really funny, actually, and... Combine a couple of relevant buffs. Well, the big issue is that I'm not... I'm focusing on deflections rather than Ichimonjis, so using Divine Confetti would actually not be all that helpful. I don't know. It'd be funny to try. See how much of a difference it would make. Because it is a flat damage buff. It is undeniably the case. Every little advantage we can get is going to be almost crucial. Okay. Thank you, and Bigger just... Snowy. Thanks. Just... Slam on you, and just... Thanks. Nice, and... One. One. Two. Two, three. Four, and... Alright, cool. Slam on you, and... Nice. One. Two, and... One, and... Oh, wow, okay. Never mind. I thought that one... Emergency dodge would have been enough because of how far away I was. That was not the case. Okay. Huh, but... Divine Confetti combined with the Ashadiku should be pretty good. Won't be crazy. Crazy increase in damage, but... I'm not sure if it only increases vitality damage or also posture damage. I'd presume it would increase both, but I cannot be sure. Hmm. Oh, all right. Once I get all of the upgrades, I literally will have nothing to do with free materials other than sell them for scrap and divine confetti. Funny to think about, really. Okay, cool. Here's the spirit fall. Go in and take him out. Okay. One, two. One, two. One. Ah, never mind. Never mind. Okay. Just the speed is. The speed is obnoxious. Okay. <sighs> Mm -hmm. Okay. Just don't want to deal with the dragon rot. It's if I die on each in phase three, I'll keep going. Maybe if an, even if I die on phase two. But dying on Genichiro, dying on each in phase one, I cannot accept that. The big thing is just I need to save up the big guns. If I use stuff like Mortal Draw in early phases, I'm just not gonna have what I need. Be very specific about how I use every single thing I have. Starting to actually, actually deplete my emblem stock too, which is great. One, two, and just one, two. One, two, and can I slam that down on your head? Thank you. One, two, and one, two. I, okay, never mind. I, okay. Oh my goodness. I did really well, except for the fact that I tried to. I thought I could Ichimonji after 
Blocking is big overhand. It's just... I need to focus on deflex. I cannot do anything other than deflect. Now maybe if I really, really learned the pattern, I would know exactly when I could weave in my own counter strikes, but... It... It's tough. The big thing is, yeah, that Genichiro... You can wear him down, his posture down relatively easy, but... Unlike Demon, honestly, as inconsistent as Demon was... You can, you could have, I could have, I could kind of turtle him, and I didn't hate that. Is that you know, focus on when I wanted to go in? But these guys, if you, if you aren't aggressive, got way too much health to really, and way too many phases for all I'm trying to just get them down via health kills, which is interesting for sure, but keeps things hard. Okay, cool. Slam on you, and one, two, three, ah, but I, never mind. One, two, one, 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 two, and it's just, can I, one, two, and, oh my goodness, I, that Shodiku was fun, and definitely probably what I want to do to just end, actually, if, if I don't need to worry about ending phase one quickly, and I really don't. It's one divine confetti based for phase, and then... Well, whatever. Divine confetti combined with Akos for each phase, and then... The big thing is just... Akko versus Yashariku, you know, the difference between full health and half health at max is the difference between being able to live an Ishin combo or at least part of one and just dying instantly and yeah. The amount of additional attack from Yashariku versus Akko is not enough to really make it worth losing any health and having to store anything that I can avoid having to spend gourds on. It's also just costless emblems. Okay. Cool. Thanks. Slam and alright, I waited longer than I should have, but we're fine. And hit slam down on you, and that rush attack is actually very nice. And nice. One and can I Ah, oh, never mind. I can come on. Nice, 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 and cool. Dodge, okay. What? What? Okay. Wow. Uh, I... That Mikiri was a problem. Okay. It... And it really does just depend on the attacks that he decides to use. You know, sometimes he's an attack that I can... deal with pretty easily. Sometimes he's an attack that I can hardly deal with at all. It's... I don't know what makes him use... Floating Passage. And the funny thing is that you can kind of just spam Deflect when he uses it and go to get a good amount of Deflects off. Because it is just a bunch of silly hits, but... Mm -mm. It's just... Focusing on a little bit of damage, a little bit of survivability, but... As cool as it would be to maybe use Ungos, the issue is that... Well, one, that I don't have a lot of them, but also just... Even a small amount of damage helps with dealing with your posture regeneration. The fact that this increases the posture damage dealt to them when I deflect, which is something I would have to be doing no matter who I was fighting, is important. One, two, and... One... One, ah, but I, never mind. One, two, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and thanks. Oh, I, wait, what? Never mind. I, okay. That has a very, very significant delay. Okay. Almost a whole second, probably to, probably to catch you. 
Okay. That just not using Yasha Deku really does just significantly increase my margin of error, which is good. Cool. Alright. It would be funny to just try to boost my attack power. Do a bunch of grinding and it gets stronger. But I, I, I've got confetti, I've got I show Deku stuff. If all else does not work, I can literally just farm spirit emblems. Which would not be all that fun and nowhere near ideal, but possible if necessary. But I wait, what? Huh? Huh? Okay. This is not intending or expecting that one. And slam and oh no, never mind. Once uh, I was in a really, really bad location for that. <sighs> Getting it to connect is actual agony. Whatever. Deck that I used. Uh, you know, plenty of times I've used a basic attack when I was intending to use a combat art. Very few times do I do a basic deflect attempt to do a combat art. Just what happened that time. Hmm. So the big question is, what combat art would be better for this fight than the Ichimonji that I'm using, Sakura Dance, which I can't get until I beat the game, or just... <sighs> the Mortal Draw, which I'm saving for other phases, should I use it at all? I did not intend to do that. Okay, cool. Let's just do this anyway. Let's go for it. And can I use the Akko? Cool. And just go in and slam down on you. That actually worked. That is well. And uh but up nice. And really, really? What? Honestly, the big thing about this game is just how bad dodging actually is. You know, just... There are no iframes whatsoever. Which is part of why Demon of Hazard is so agonizing. You can't just... iframe, for example, the storm switch. In a standard Souls game, would undoubtedly be the best way to do it. And the fact that using the game's actual shield is tied to spirit elms is also kind of insane. Well, whatever. Hmm. Well, well. Okay. Just take down Ganichiro, take down Ishin. Survive. Okay. It is good. It is very, very strong, but... Still. Okay, cool. Thanks, thanks. And. One, two. One, two. One. One. Thanks. And. Thanks. One, two. What are you gonna do now? Well, you're gonna stand still. Okay. One. Thanks, okay. Weird. Alright. One, two, and. Cool, cool. Alright, and. Slam that down on you, and the Akko's buff is already gone. One. Thanks, and. Okay, cool. Give it. What? Huh? Thanks. One, two, and. One, two, and. One, two. And. Wait, what? Huh? Really? Oh my goodness. Ah, it's a bad place to be for the fight. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. And 
and I have... Oh, interesting. So... I suppose that if you have only one sen, it won't drain any for you, because it can't evenly divide one sen. It's actually very funny. Okay. Hmm. It's gonna leave you with one singular sen. No matter what. Okay. Okay. Alright then. Alright then. Okay. Mm -hmm. Slam, slam, and one, two, one, one, and can I, one, two, one, two, thanks, thanks, and, all right, get out of the way, slam that down, and, one, thanks, and, one, two, John, thanks, oh, what, really, that, uh, the degree to which that Nikiri is just... One, two... And... Alright. Cool. And... Bring that down on your head, and... Cool. One... Ah, really? Why is that as fast as it is? Okay. Okay. What was that that... The delay on that Nikiri is what really makes it annoying. Also, the fact that somehow... Maybe it's because I was dodging the side in a head instead of just directly ahead. Sometimes Ichin's thrust would actually just go right past me and deny me the Nikiri opportunity, which was really weird. Definitely, though... Given how important the Nikiri is going to be for the other part of the fight, it is very good that I got Shinobi Eyes a while ago. There's nothing like Shinobi Eyes. The upgrade that gives you more posture damage against enemies on a Nikiri. There's something like the jump, sort of Goomba Stomp counter. But I don't know what we have. Okay. Okay. Cool. Thanks. Slam on you, and just... Thanks, and nice, and thanks. One, one, two, one. Thanks. Can we move in, and slam, slam on you. One, two, and... Alright. Cool. And move in. And I slam on you, and move you down, and... One, one, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. And thanks, thanks. Uh oh, what? You have to wait until. Okay. One, two. Thanks. One. Uh. One, two, and. One, two, and. Bring that down on your head. Thanks. And one, two. One. Ah, uh, but I cannot. One, two, and. One, two, die. Alright. Cool. Alright. Let's try next phase. Now we can use our confetti, use our other buffs. That went okay. Big thing is, is that I have to wait until, in terms of counting Genichiro's thrust, wait until the glint goes all the way down the sword. That's what it seems to be to me. Alright, come on. Come on. And, can we? Come on. Two. And, thanks. Alright, nice. And, immediately. Ichimonji. And, one. Two. One. And, thanks. And, one. Ooh, I, alright. Thanks. Okay, cool. Hi, right, okay. One. Two. And, just one. Two. One, and thanks, all right, and one, two, one, two, three, and twice, and cool, and put that down on you, we're doing, okay, thanks, and nice, one, ooh, I, okay, wow, I didn't think that combo would continue, we were actually doing very well for ourselves, okay. 
Okay. Okay. It felt good again that one. I almost got the posture kill. But... Uh, Yashodiku is not something I can afford to try using, but... At least not unless I get really, really, really desperate. But... I don't know what wave. Uh, okay. Okay. Cool. Let's rest. And then... Mm -hmm. Keep on going. Keep on going. Hmm. Uh, we're getting better, slowly but surely, but this is just... Really is, probably, the hardest pure challenge in terms of just pure skill in a video game I've had. Slam, slam on you, and just... One, two... One, uh, but I, okay, one, two, one, and jump it, okay, oh, I, never mind, I, okay, cool, slam it, I, really, 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 okay, that was actually really, really stupid and embarrassing, it's just, dodge and the jump in conjunction is having to decide between the two and remember which is which, I am not. Happy. Okay. So the big question is, now that the game has regressed tonight, oh, probably the best place to grind Spirit Elms would still be Mibu Village because of all the places where dudes just keep crawling out of the ground. Hmm. That place did not get all that much harder. I should still be able to kill with a single sword bow no matter what happens. That said, having to grind spirit emblems would be truly just the height of desperation. Okay, cool. Uh -huh. Okay, cool. Move in and swing that down on your head. Thanks. And one, two, one, one, and okay, can I? Mm, but I, never mind. Uh, okay. Slap. Oh, but I, God damn you! Go to hell! Okay, I... There are basically zero attacks that I can actually try to get a counter hit on other than the Mortal Draw. And for Ishin, the only attack I can really try to get a heck counter hit in, uh, in on is his Mikiri counter. But also, the... The Wind Slashes also leave him pretty... Vulnerable, but hmm. the big issue is it's hard to tell whether he's going to use the overhead slam or the horizontal sweep, and the horizontal sweep is much longer of a window of opportunity. I mean, has a much it's a bit of a delay before the deflection. Hmm. It's really just. It's a tough fight with a lot of reflexes needed, various timings that are delayed or sped up. Well, not delayed or sped up, just fast and slow timings. It's really just the game's final test, honestly. I, I'm not, uh, but I, third attack is one, and okay, now you're standing still. One, two, three, four. Thanks. And dodge. Okay, cool. Move in. Slam that down on you. And one. Thanks. Thanks. And okay. Can I bring that down on you? Or one, two, and one, two, and bring that down on you. And one, and. Thanks, 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 thanks. Cool. Good old... Uh, floating passage. Okay, cool. Use a bit more confetti. Have any in storage. That's great. Okay. Then we'll use our... Akko. Thanks. Cool. Go for your... Ashin across, please. I'm begging you. It's my best bet. 
One and one. Okay, one and thank you. What? Okay, thanks and swing that down and one, two. Thanks. I thanks. All right and slam, slam. Just one, two, three and twice and jump it. Swing that down on you and oh, but I'm not. Can I one, two and one, two. Thanks. All right and swing, swing and one, two, three. Oh, but ah, oh, really? Times were just off. This is just wrong. The worst part is, is that I think I was probably still doing it quickly enough that it was giving me the spam penalty, so to speak, which is really stupid. But how, how am I going to... And that's the worst feeling of all. Having to do a farming run while fighting a boss. Just... The fact that... I mean, Divine Confetti is one thing. Because that's an additional buff beyond everything else, but... Having to buy everything else... is ridiculous. The fact that Spirit Elements will slowly defeat it's just... Yeah! And there's no glitch you can just use there. If it doesn't work, you're just screwed. Mm -hmm. I don't have much of anything to sell. I... I guess, but... I guess... It's so desperate I've gotten. Ceramic shards and clumps of ash and... Don't even... Don't even know. The fact that it cost us so much... Okay. I mean, in the end, I probably... I'm not dealing a lot of actual hits. I probably don't really need the Devon Confetti. But it's not going to be fun when I have to literally farm other stuff. <clears throat> when I actually have to start farming for emblems. But... Spirit Emblem capacity is frankly pretty low. Okay. I might... Let's keep going. No divine confetti, just pure Yashariku. Just try to see how much difference that makes. But I want. Oh, but I. Speed is just. You see it? You're too late. Thanks. Okay. Okay. It's probably just other people in the house moving around, frankly. This house does not have very good seal off. Okay. One, two. Hitting the mic again, obviously. And, oh, can I... Thanks, thanks. And two. All right, and... Can I slap... Oh, die. One. Thank you, one, die, and die. Okay. Alright. Okay. I might be able to just... Wait for the Divine Confetti. Use it now. And I'm not dealing that many hits. Yeah. One, and... Just... Can I? One, two... Well, the Confetti buff were off. 
Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, ah, uh, but uh, timing is tough. I. One, two. Okay. Cool. And one, two. Ah, uh, but I uh, want. Thanks, thanks. Ah, uh, but why was that one so delayed? Okay. Uh, you know what? I don't care anymore. We're going for Yashadiku. Uh, okay. One, two, three. But I, mm. Okay, nice. One, two. Slam down on you. And just... Thanks. Alright. And... This is actually a very important difference. One, two... Three, and thanks, and can I, wait, what? Never mind, and, wow, yeah, that, that's actually crucial. Never mind. Okay, so, having the Yashariku to actually just increase posture damage gel is very important there. Keep this on, and one, two, two, th three. Okay, cool, and nice. All right. Oh, but I, what? Huh? Okay. Huh. I really should be. Akko combined with a. <sighs> Akko sugar combined with just mortal draws, maybe. The big thing is that his combo length is so oppressive. Hmm. If. The big thing is, is that I think I've actually gotten to a good point in terms of learning his patterns for phase one. Okay, but yeah, I do have a good amount of spirit emblem still, but it's just, yeah, it's very, yeah, you know. Going all in on the Yashariku Spirit Fall. Okay. And. One, two. One, two. Three. But I. What? Never mind. You. Okay. One, two. Thanks, thanks. And just. What are we gonna do now? Slam on you. And just. One, two. And one, two, and move in, and in, slam. Okay, I. Uh, what? How did I. Right, because I just keep on. failing to get the stupid. mortal draw. I mean, the Ichimonji off the weapon arc is the. I. I really wish, and I know why they didn't do it. I kind of wish the double shoulder input was for. the grappling hook. And ZL was for combat arts. Because it is really funny that every combat art is you hold down two shoulder buttons at once, and ZL is literally just for the grappling hook and nothing else. The grappling hook is a cool, cool gameplay element, but it does feel like a misalignment of priorities to me. A little. I don't know. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Guess if we had the divine confetti, we may as well use it to help out a little while we're in. Then hopefully things will get easier from there. But I'm really not counting on it. Okay, cool. Thanks. Two and one, two, three, one. Once, thanks, and oh, I all right. One, two, I, okay. Oh, never mind. I okay, cool. Oh, my damn you. Ah, it was actually pretty good, except for until that happened. I do feel like he kind of heats things up if you take down a lot of his health quickly. It makes sense. Uh, it, it would make sense if it was the case. 
Hmm. To believe that this game is about five years old. Kind of crazy. Hmm. It's just a little before Elden Ring. Elden Ring came out in 2022. So Elden Ring itself is almost equidistant between Sekiro and the rest of the Elden Ring DLC. Surely. An over two year gap between Elden Ring and DLC is kind of crazy though. There are a lot of people, honestly myself included, who kind of consider it to be. Based on you know what we've heard about, just the size of it. Almost a stealth sequel. More than just the standard quote unquote DLC expansion. Thanks. And cool. Thanks. One. And. Jump! Okay, cool. One, two. Gonna sh counter that sweep right. Alright! I'm excited. It's gonna be some trouble, but. Thanks! And. Oh, never mind. I okay, cool. And there we have it. Nice. Okay, cool. So, we actually didn't spend anything on that hardly. Use the... I'll show the Akuta Spirit Ball again. Thank you, cool. Go ahead. Thanks, and cool. And, alright, and cool. Thanks. Go ahead, use... Thanks. And... Once... Oh, well... Damn! Ah, oh, I... That's the thing, it's just... Did they grab you? You mean the Elden Ring manga? The Elden Ring manga is a joke manga. It's not serious. It's a humorous manga, not an adaptation of the game, really. I mean, it is an adaptation of the game, but it's... Closer to a sort of joke for coma kind of thing than a... I didn't know there was one. I heard about the Elden Ring one. And I thought you might have been mixing them up. But, d what, did that just come out, or has it been out for a while? I didn't even know about that. But I guess a lot about it is... <sighs> There's not enough story to adapt in most Souls games. Lore events are interesting enough, but... <sighs> it'd be hard to adopt them. Well, I didn't see it. Sorry. Apologies. Okay. One, two. One, two, three. Oh, but I. Really? Thanks. 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 And it's official? Oh, interesting. Okay. One, two. One, two. And. Alright, and. Can we slam that down on your head? And one, one, two, three, four, five, six, and I can, oh my goodness, okay, cool, nice, and die, thank you very much, okay, cool. Well, I, I just didn't see it. I like to be responsive, it's just, I legitimately did not see. And, okay, alright, okay, oh, interesting. That is cool, I just did not know about it. One, two, one, two, one, thanks, okay, I, oh, alright, interesting. One, two, thanks, alright, and, can we send that down on you, and, but, Yashoriku is really, really useful for this phase of the fight, and, we're almost, nice, thanks, wow, that was really quite good. So, that means... Okay. Oh, in Italy. At least ensure I'm just now arrived in Italy. Well, I'm glad to hear you got back to Italy, then. Okay, cool. And, oh my goodness. Okay, so... Use this. Okay, and... Nice, nice. Oh, right, you do have your gun. That's right! Come on. Let's go for it. Can I... Cool, and... Can I... Nice, nice, and... Can I... Thanks! Thanks, thanks, and... Alright. Cool. And can I... 
slam, slam on you, and twice. Oh, but I, hmm, that's right, I want to be using Mortal Draw for this. That's right. Instead of Ichimanji. Use this, and one, two, three, four, and cool. Nice, and all right, cool. Slam on you, and oh, my, never mind. Okay, cool. And I, oh, well, never mind then. Okay, cool, and done. Oh, never mind, and okay. Please, okay. I, I'm in a decent position. Just gotta figure out how to block, I mean. How to get your spear attacks out of the way using. You are a lunatic, frankly, so. One, two, and. Well, we're out of that. One. You're actually a good deal easier to take down, I presume. Just depending on. We can ensure you'll go for that attack. We can. Thanks! Alright. Yeah. Now that we're here, we can. Thanks. Mm -hmm. I I don't doubt it honestly. It's just I hadn't heard of it. it. Feels surprising to me that they have new Dark Souls manga after all this time. I guess the question is just what perspective are they going to take in terms of which ending is canon and which isn't? Cause, you know they've always got the choice of ending. I presume that they'll probably choose the one that's more you know light oriented, but. Cool, and... Oh, I messed that up. I messed that up entirely. Okay. Cool. It is interesting. I appreciate that. I, okay. Interesting. And... Alright. One. Spin and... Oh, my goodness. I, anyway, it is a good idea, but... I'm nice, and can I... Oh, wow. Okay. Cool. I'm not going for the Mikiri. Countering his Mikiri is a good idea. Okay. Oh, there might not be other chapters yet. It's possible. Thanks, and cool. Nice. Cool, and then we can... And... Thanks, thanks, and... Oh, we miss. Thanks. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Oh, huh. Nice. Oh, my... Okay. Wow. Alright. Thanks, and can I... Nice slam and thanks. Uh -huh. Thanks. And how am I gonna Nice, nice, and can I Oh but I ah, never mind. I, okay. Mm -hmm. Farthest I've ever gotten. But I I need to be more aggressive most likely. Thanks and oh wow, okay. Nice. And can I stank? Well, uh, never mind. I, the big thing is, is I tried doing it. The mortal draw. The mortal draw is just not worth it. Mortal draw ain't worth it. I just need to. Yeah, the big thing is that in the final phase, I can literally just run away from him until he starts using lightning attacks and then just hit him with his own lightning. And that will be... Far simpler to deal with. It's just... If I hadn't been using Yashariku, I could have been silly maybe, and then tried using a bunch of Mortal Draws on him. But I ran out of... emblems for Mortal Draw very quickly. Because the emblems I was using for Yashariku. Maybe things could have been a little different if I had... I don't know, more spirit emblems by way of up, do the upgrades that give you more spirit emblems. But it's just not what I'm really trying to do right now, especially since so many of Tantra would also be really, really annoying to get working. I didn't have that much more confetti, but we'll be okay for now. Mm -hmm. Alright, then we got closer. The big thing is I need to focus on fighting normally instead of trying to... Oh, well, I... That's right, I'm a, I'm a complete idiot. Forgot I still had Ichimonji equipped. And that was legitimately incredibly embarrassing. Hmm. Oh, I forgot that I needed to re-equip Ichimonji. Interest... Oh, interesting. But like I said... 
Dark Souls is fundamentally not a narrative game. Sekiro is, and that's one of Sekiro's unique strengths. But Dark Souls, generally speaking, most of the meaningful events in, in the setting happen well before you come on the scene. And you basically play a murderous janitor. Your job is to clean up the mess by basically killing everyone of note. Which is different. It's not to say that the game is, you know, uninteresting, but most of the interesting story aspects are, well, there's nothing they could really add without being non-canon, I think. Oh, I, ah, never mind, okay. Slam on you. One, two. Thanks. And nice. One, two. Three, and nice. And out of the way. Thank you. Now, dodge. Oh, what in the goddamn? Really? Oh. Okay. Okay. Hmm. There aren't a lot of good openings. Maybe. Well, just, it wouldn't be all that interesting to stream. And maybe probably not even all that interesting as a video either. I don't know. But, it's just running low on emblems, but the Yashariku is going to be crucial. Probably going to use the Akko for Ishin Phase 2. The worst part is legitimately just, if I had been, especially since in Phase 2 he gets pretty good at, pretty, he does a lot of Mikiris actually. Could probably just have... What wings? What kind of bird are you? Are you a bird? A bat? Thanks. Slam, slam. One, one, oh, but I, really, really, two, one, 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 two, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and just one, can I, okay, thank you, and what are you going to do, slam on you, and just one, two, and one, Alright, and bring this down. Thanks, thanks. Die, die, die. Okay, cool. Goodbye. Thank you. Cool. Okay. Nice. Let's just use this and then use Yashariku again. Most likely. Aka was good, but the Yashariku difference is actually very significant. Maybe. It's an idea, but I don't know. Thanks, and cool. Right, and one, two, three. Mm, okay. Is this to regain posture? And one. Thanks. All right, and one, two, one, two, three, four. Oh, but ah, the fact that he can keep just keep going sometimes is you can never ever just let up. Maybe on stream. Because that takes work. It takes a lot more work than just... <laughs> you have to post it to YouTube. And also, YouTube is actually starting to decline now. Google, in general, is... destroying itself. In particular... They're changing the way that ads work on Google. I mean, on YouTube, to make it just... To totally make it impossible for Adblock to work. In that, they're putting... Well, it's not just that. This is something entirely different. What they're doing to YouTube specifically is that they're preventing any kind of ad blocker from working. By injecting the ads directly into... Essentially, the bitstream of the video. Which is to say that... There will be no marker differentiating the video itself from 
Oh my. Oh. Oh my. Damn. There'll be no marker in the data stream differentiating ads from the video you're actually trying to watch. Which means that there won't be any innate tag that an ad blocker can just cut out to make you not have to watch ads. And, yeah. Just in general, there are articles about this, that I, like I said, that I can post that essentially there was a big internal feud between the monetization team in Google is in the ad makers and the computer engineers who actually, you know, make Google work. And to make a long story short, the ad people won. Which is kind of why things have gotten how they are. I guess the question is, maybe I should just be using Akos anyway. Consuming a lot less, I would have to worry a lot less about just dying. Okay, cool. Cool. One, two. One, two, three. Ah, oh, but I. One, two. One, two. Thanks. Thanks. And. Alright. One, two. And. Alright, and. Move back in and take you out. One. And. Jump. Okay. Slam, slam, and one, one, two, and cool. Oh, I, oh, never mind. Thank you. And, all right, and move in and take you out. Cool. Die. All right. Thanks. Okay. Okay. Cool. So we need as much as we can possibly can. Let's use that Anko again. This should be usable, but go ahead, use your thanks. Oh, okay. Thanks. Thanks to thanks. To... Oh my. Ah, never mind. Okay. Cool. All right. One, two, three, and can I slam, slam on you? And one, two, and I. Okay, can I slam this down? Yeah, we can. One, two, three. Ah, but I. Ah. I. Hmm. Alright, alright. Spirit Ball is crucial, but. Okay. Hmm. Go for your option across, and I can. Ah, never mind. I can. Slam, slam. And one, two, three. And can I Nice and oh, I can't actually even dodge that. That really sucked. Okay. It's getting really tough. Okay. One. Thanks. Alright, and that Mukiri is going to be crucial. Right. One, two, and can I one, two, and Thanks, and, well, what? Never mind, I, okay. One, two, and, can I, nice, can I slam on you again, and, go for the mickety, I, nice. Thanks, and, can I, thanks, alright, and just, can we slam that down again, cool. Nice, cool, nice, cool, and, can I slam that down on you, or, Nice, cool, nice, cool, and nice. Ah, and we blocked your dash and it therefore rooted you in place. It's actually quite silly. Okay, cool. So we're back to phase two. Alright, and. Cool, and. Thanks. Oh, what? Okay, never mind. And nice, nice. Oh, well, I. Okay, cool. And I. Slam that down on you, or. Nice and cool. Cannot. Oh well, never mind. Glock. Classic Glock Saint Ishin. Nice and oh, never mind. I, okay. Ah oh, and nice and ah. Oh. Spear is crazy. Okay, I really need him to go for the Mikiri. 
Thanks. Thanks, thanks. Oh, never mind. Nice. Yeah, nice. Can I slap? Oh, never mind. Okay. Oh. Thanks. Alright, and we can. So we slam that down on you. Nice. One. Like, oh, nice. So tough. And nice. Okay, can we slam on you? And there we are. Nice. Oh, but I. Mm, mm. Thanks. And can I slam, slam. The wind ups are much more usable, but. Mm, can I slam? Ah, oh, but I. Okay. Thanks. And, and we can slam that down on your head. And can I just. Slam and oh my goodness! Actually, really? Okay, never mind. I this one went pretty well, but honestly, this would be decent Yashadiku plus Mortal Draw fodder. Actually, I hate to say it, I'd have to do that. At least Akko plus Mortal Draw Fodder, just because... Oh, the deflections and posture damage are... Really just horrible. Okay. And since her health was so low, her posture was barely recovering, period. It's funny. Okay. But... Phase 1 actually went pretty well. We're in the other phases now. Got 84 remaining spirit emblems. Alright. Cool, cool. One, two, three. Ah, oh, ah, oh, sound that wrong. And I can. One, two. One. And can I. Slam, slam. One, two. Nice. And cool. Slam again, and just one, two, and can I slam it down on your head, and one, can, one, and can I jump, and thanks, die, 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 okay, thank you, thank you, okay, that is sick at all, use our Mako, thank you. Cool. The Ashina Cross or something. Uh, okay. Two. Thanks. And one, two. Chunks and posture. And one, two. And can I dodge? Okay, cool. And one, two. So. Uh, thanks. And can I. Wait, what? And I. Okay. Mickey just not working was. Really strange. And nice to dodge a bit to the side then. It's fine. One, two, three, and not. Nice! Okay, and jump and immediately slam down on you and we're close. Nice. Thanks. There we are! Oh my goodness. I am learning the way of the sword. It's crazy to think. Okay, let's then use another spirit fall. Get a few mortal draws off and just ah, oh, never mind. Okay, cool, nice. Got a few hits, but I can. Thanks, thanks, thanks. Cool. Thanks. All right, and okay. Oh wow, that hit me. That was really bad. Okay. Thanks, and can we... Ah, oh, never mind. Oh, that Nikiri is for sure going to be what I want to try to go for in order to actually get a counter off. But, uh, thing is, I can probably use some parts of the geography to block him. Maybe I'm probably a bit too close for this. Definitely a bit too close for this, but come on, come on, and can I... Cool. Mm -mm. Cool. And just. Ah, uh, never mind. I could. Thanks. Dodge. Ah, uh, never mind. Nice. And. Cool. 
And we'll use oh, any more if better. Thanks. And we can slam and one, two, and alright. Thanks. Alright, move out of the way. Cool. One, two, and alright, and just use your funny thanks. Funny Mikiri counterattack. And nice. And we immediately jog and pull that off. And yeah, damage was good. And let's just heal. It worked. Decent. And nice. 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 And thanks. We need to probably switch to Ichimonji most likely. And. And cool. Can try this out. And nice. Nice. Thanks. Okay. And just can we slam, slam, and. Oh, my. Oh, oh. Die. Does it look like phase three? I think it looks like phase three. Okay. Which means eel liver. Well, it means we run away and then use an eel liver. Thank you. Nice. It's time for fun. And this could be it. It's got to banish the lightning. And whenever you use the. Okay, never mind. Okay, cool. Heal and just dodge, dodge, and. Huh? We could be in danger. Let's use that lightning, we will be in good position. Gotta run away from you as much as possible. Just when you jump up and use lightning. If you jump up and use lightning, we'll be good. And. Okay. Deflect. Jump up, hit me with your lightning. Or not. Go up. Go for the lightning reversal and... Oh, come on. Uh, jump it! Okay. Well, never mind. Ah, huh, okay. Now it's the only thing I need. Okay. Nice. Gotta get hit by the lightning correctly. This is a matter of... Okay, nice. We got stuck on a rock briefly, but... Come on, come on. Jump up! Yeah, the lightning on me. Okay, and cool. Nice. Okay, and ah, oh, thanks. Oh. Nice. Ah, oh, nice. Ah, oh, but I'm such a bad position. Okay. Okay. Just thank you. Uh, what? No, never mind. Okay, I we only use lightning if I get decently close to you. It's certainly possible. I. Uh, Need you to use lightning attacks. Come on, come on. Uh, nice. Cool. And. Okay. Alright. I think it's the only thing I can actually guarantee. Uh, thanks. Okay. Come on. And. Alright. Thanks. Go up. Use your lightning. Ah. Thanks. Alright. Just thanks. Nice. This is slow and painstaking, but cannot afford to be silly about this. Just lightning will bring this home. Give me the power of lightning. Okay. Nice. Oh really? Come on. You gotta be kidding. Give me the power of what? No, no. I what? No, I can't actually afford to... Come on, can we slam down on you and... Okay. Need to be... Even in spite of the... Come on, okay. I... Have to use this power. Okay. Everything for the final one. Nice. And... Once you use your lightning... That is all there is. Lightning. Now, maybe I could try using Empowered Mortal Drawn Theory, but it's just. And. Ah, but I'm. Nice. Go ahead, use your. Use your Lightning Reversal. It's just. If we run straight away from you, I'm sure we get hit more or less, but I. Thanks, and. Nice. Ah, oh, come on, I- okay? Spear is crazy. 
Oh, nice. Got to keep my block up. So we go for lightning to reverse. I, okay. Cool. Come on. I, okay. Did you get lightning on you, or am I? Well, almost. It's the only thing I can tr even remotely guarantee. Ah. Come on. The, ah. Come on. I, okay. How did that even hit me? I'm losing my mind. Yeah, I. Huh. One, two, three, four. And. Okay. Cool. I. Uh, let's go and. Jump up. Try to go for lightning. Please, I'm begging you. What am I even gonna be able to. Lightning reverses aren't having nearly as much as I would like, but I can. can we, nice! We can get some hits in. By way of. Nice. Cool. And. Oh my. Whatever. Okay. Can I swing on you and just jump it? Okay, never mind. I. Ah, oh, stupid. Okay. Build in. Well! You were. Mayoeba Yaburero. Okay. The big thing is, is as fun as it would be to try to. I actually can't afford to run away from him no matter what, no matter when. More unseen A, that's funny. You literally do have to engage him directly or you can't win. It's actually crazy. Okay. In that case, we're just going to keep going with Akko Spirit Falls. Those mobile draws are not going to be doing anything for me. Okay, cool. Oh, we got to phase one. Oh, and I forgot again. You're kidding. Stupid. Okay. Just kill me already. Or not. 65 remaining spirit emblems. Okay. Okay. It is honestly funny that he does say face me Sekiro. And arguably, he is the easiest to deal with if you actually get up in his face. You know... A sense that it's a test of courage more than a more than anything else maybe it's such a crazy fight okay okay hmm. oh whatever keep going with the Akko Yashariko is again way too risky Come on, come on. Cool, cool. One, two, three, four. One. And just slam down. Once you back away, that's our heal. One, two. And you're gonna run in or what? Oh, never mind. You, okay. Oh, please. That was really, really stupid. Okay. Come on. Well, we got to the final phase, and quite frankly, if I'd been more aggressive, I would have won. <laughs> Maybe. Got there with a good amount of healing, it's just... My use of it was... inadvisable. Okay. Because once you, you know, get the lightning attack on him, that's perfect opportunity to chunk... His vitality even more when he stays still, or at least his posture, but... I was just running away, trying to bait lightning attacks, but... It doesn't always work that way. And especially since, if you're not running straight towards him or straight away from him... It's a good chance that he doesn't even hit you with the lightning. Yeah, it... He's definitely one of the hardest fights in From. Okay. One, two, three, one, one, and jump and stand down. One, two, thanks, thanks, and one, and can we, two, and can I, one, uh, can I, okay, one, zero, and jump and 
send it down. Okay, nice. And come on, come on, and dodge. Okay, nice. Then we get. That was not a great way to. One, two, and go. One, two, and just one. Thank you. It might have. There might be various other kinds of misalignment in the computer. That's the thing. Computer does have its own issues. Come on. One. And just go ahead. One, two. Nice. Thank you. And slam, slam, and one, two, and we. No, I, uh, but I, never mind. Okay, cool. I need. Can I slam chunk a bit more posture? Cranks and okay. Can I? Uh, I went the wrong way. It's forward is good, but went too forward and I. Uh, never mind. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's use this to reapply Akos, but it's. There's nothing that can ever make this fight easy, but you become less hard. One, and thanks, and one, two, one, two, thanks, and can we- oh, nice, thanks, and oh my goodness, okay, cool. Dodge, and can I- two, can I- one, two, ah, oh, never mind. Yeah, it's just, you literally cannot afford to try healing, except during phase transitions, honestly. The big thing, really, is just... Whenever he charges up his wind attack, I need to run away, and as soon as he moves... If you just run to the side, you can dodge it entirely, but... It's also relatively easy to deflect if you time it right when it goes horizontally. The big issue is you need to be... You need to know what it's going to be because he's got two options there. The funny thing is, is that if the big wind slash he does, you get the vertical one as a weapon art once you beat him in this ending. It's called Dragon Flash, but when you... There's no way to get the horizontal one. Except it's probably not as good anyway. Whatever. All right then. All right. Cool. Open up. Nice. Nice. And I did not need to do that. Never mind. I reflecting it wasn't horrible, but I did not intend to. That was also just really, really stupid. I, I don't know what's up with this controller then. It might have fallen again too many times, but it might be a difference in the way I'm interacting. But the fact is that I'm. Using the... I'm using a normal deflect when I'm trying to use a weapon art, and that is annoying. I think it would probably be good to use the Divine Confetti I have, but to save it for Ishin, maybe Ishin Phase 2. Maybe. Big thing is that Ishin Phase 3 is not as threatening, because it's just Phase 2. He's a little more aggressive and also... He has lightning, which is actually more of a benefit to the player than him. But we'll live. Yeah, pass two. All I have to do is be properly aggressive when the other phase starts. Nice slam and thanks, thanks. Nice. Can I oh I can nice. One can I one Two, one, and can I slam that down on you, and one, two, nice, 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 and just jump and slam that down on your head, thanks. One, two, can I, thank you, thank you, one, can I, thanks, thanks, and just thank you, thanks, thanks. Good old floating passage, good for me. Okay, cool. Not as sick at all. Let's use our 
Uh, or Arco Spiritfall again. Thank you. Go ahead. Use something. Thanks. But. Thanks. One, two. Thanks. One, two. And. One, two. And. Can I. Okay, nice. And. Thanks. Cool. Slam on you. And. One, two, three, four. And. Thanks. Alright. One, two. One, two. And. Can I. And you back up a little to try to regain, but we. One, two, thanks, and one, two, and one, two, three, and just thanks. Oh, I, never mind. Okay, cool. Can we slam down on you, and just one, two, and can I? One, two, three, not slam down again, and cool. Thanks, and okay, now, well, what? What? Never mind. I, okay. And because he is weirdly hard to guarantee and what? Okay. And that's the issue, just. If you miss one, trying to deflect the others becomes so much harder because of the penalty to. Penalty for repeated deflections. Uh, uh, okay. We were doing really, really well. It's just. You really are on the razor's edge for that fight. But you're either always... The difference between re doing really well and death is always... very narrow. This... Again, it's probably the... greatest pure challenge I've experienced in a video game. At least a pure challenge that feels fair instead of just stupid. The only thing here is just me, the boss, and my own skill or lack thereof. Everything else is... Superfluous. Nice. Cool. Nice. Cool. One. Cool. And nice. What two. And... Okay. Ah, uh, two. Three. Four. Can we move in? Slam again. And one. Can I slam again and nice. One, two, three, four. And can I slam on your head and just one, two, thank you. One, two, and move in, slam that down, and cool. One ah no, I was so close. It's just I can't afford to use any gourds on phase one. I do use a gourd to heal back up to full the phase. Phase 2 is in phase 1 Asian, but... Okay. I did not call you superf superfluous. Why do you think I called you superfluous? Okay. Keep on going, keep on going. I... Uh, 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 uh. The moron support, if you say so. You can describe yourself however you like. Uh, 49 remaining spirit emblems. I don't want to have to go grind spirit emblems for this. Okay, let's just get to phase again. And can I? One, two. Chunk that posture. One, one. Can I slam? Oh, but I, never mind it. Not never. Not one, one, thanks, can I, oh, but, what, oh, oh 47 left, okay. but especially with Bell Demon, I really, really need that additional damage from Alco. I will save Divine Confetti. Phase 2 Ishin. Shouldn't be needed anywhere else, presumably. We'll see. So I do kind of feel as if once that lightning reversal comes out on Phase 3 Ishin, 
The big thing is that phase 3 Asian starts up pretty much immediately. You should switch to Powered Mortal Draw to just chunk further health damage when we get him hit with a lightning reversal. Okay, cool. Alright. Cool, cool. One, two, one, one, two, one, two. Big thing is that when that comes up, it's a lot of annoyance there. And one, and scroll and jump it. Slam, slam. Okay, nice. And can we slam that down on you? And cool. One, two, and can we. Uh, but, ah, keep missing the combat art. One, and jump and slam down on you, and we're close again, and there we go. Pretty much all the health back for that, which is really, really good. Okay. Put our Akko back on. Cool. Thank you. One, two, three, and all right. Nice. Then we... Take you out a little with one, two, thanks, thanks, and oh, what? Nice. Oh, never mind. Okay, cool. Slam down again, and not thanks. Okay, cool. One, two, one, two, three, and cannot. Uh, one, thanks. Slam with the Ashen across, and one, two, three, there we are! Lovely! Okay, cool. What that means is we can wait for you to get your spear out and use our Akko. Thanks. Cool. Thanks, and slam that down on you again, and one, and one, two, three, four, and done. Okay. Oh, wow! That brought us brought him to us. It's actually insane. Nice, nice, and um, oh, okay. We need to be at distance in order to get that working with... Nice, and can I... Ooh, please, uh, okay. Nice, nice. Wait, what? Huh? Okay. Well, I cannot afford to let this opportunity pass me by. We have that gone, but if we win, we can actually... If we get this phase down, we can actually... Take him out a little, but never mind. Nice! Nice! And can we... One, two, one, two, three, and cool. Thanks! 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 And can we... Let's go for the Mikiri. I'm begging you to go for the Mikiri. Counter! Can we... Thanks! Alright. And can we... Slam, slam again. One! Can we... One, and one, can we slam again, and just one, ah, but I'm, interesting, interesting, I don't, okay, can we slam down again on you, and one, two, three, thanks, and thanks, and can we, oh, never mind, I'm in such a state, okay, cool, one, two, and just one, two, three, and, oh my goodness. Alright then. Okay, cool. One. Two. And go for your Mikiri. I'm begging you. One. Two. Thanks. And we can... Can't hardly chunk any posture though. Not. One. Two. And gap closes. Thanks. And, oh right. That was a sweep attack. Whatever. Okay, cool. Uh, one, two, three, and all right, cool. Oh my goodness! They can get up. One, two. Come on, just go for the Mikiri. Go for the Mikiri bullet attack. And can we slam chunk a little bit of health? Thanks. One, two, and can we? Slam again, slam. Okay, nice. One. But I, ah, please. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. One, two, 
three. Ah. Then some can wait. Oh, never mind. You gotta be kidding. What? Ah. It's actually infuriating. Okay. But. <sighs> Mikiri is crazy. The thing is just taking down his posture, taking down his anything. There's nothing that can reliably pierce what he has without getting rid of my already scarce spirit emblems. One, two, three, but I can probably honestly just one, one, jump and uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One. Okay, nice. Wow, that was a really crazy fast game fight. Okay. Uh, so again, second phase. It's all going in immortal draws, honestly. It has to. Cool. One. Just because. Attacks that I can actually reliably. Oh my goodness. Okay, I need to step down to that, but whatever. Come on, come on. I did not see that coming. Okay. Come on, just. Thanks. Flash. One, two. Slam that down, slam that down. And just. Thanks. Cool. Action phase one is really, really cool, but uh. One, two, three, and just. One. Two and cool. Alright, and just can be one, two, and one, two, and thanks. But what? Okay? Uh one, two, one. Just the degree to which what? Okay. I uh big thing is just know how. Can do that. I just need to get better at reading the tell for what wind attack he's going to use. But using the Yishin phase one can go pretty well, but it's phase two where things start falling apart just because there isn't a good way to keep him. Using attacks I can actually reliably punish. The Mikiri is really the only thing, but chunking him with health damage is going to have to be the preferred method of countering him. It's just, that's going to be the only way I can do any of this. Which sucks, but it's true. We really are running out of spirit on this. Okay. Alright. And up. One! Two, we, one, two. Did not intend to do that, but we could maybe make this work. Maybe I. One, two. Thanks. One, two, three. And can we? One, two. All right. One, two. And jump. Bring that down. Thanks. All right. One. One, two. Thanks, and alright, thank you, let's bring this down on you and kill. Alright, this is decent, cool. Alright. And so, let's use our Onkos after this phase, it's gonna be all goofy, okay, cool. Come on, Ishin. One, two, three. Mm -mm. Thanks. One, two. Slam, slam, and just thanks. And before any of that other silliness comes out, well, one, two, and just thanks, and cool. Slam down on you. One, two, one, and all right, cool. 
Slam, slam, and one, two, and can we? One, two, will not let you. Thanks, thanks, and just can we? Slam, slam again, and one, two, there we are! That was really, really good. So now what that means is we need Empowered Mortal Draw for sure. And... And... Cool. And... Charge that up. And... Cool. Nice. Okay. So that... Uh, health damage is going to be crucial. Thanks. Spin and... Can we... Uh, figure out how to... Force our way in. Uh, the lightning isn't striking quite yet, but... Okay. One, two, and... Can we... Swing! Alright. I only got with it. Magic hitbox, so to speak, but we're okay. Cool. One, two, slam, and. Okay, this is actually quite good. Slam, and we could actually not guarantee, but we could. Oh, never mind! Okay. Good stuff, and. Some, okay, nice. Nice, nice. Ah. Uh, pellets for sure, but I can. One. Dodge. Oh, never mind. Okay. Just dodge. Dodge. Can we... Thanks. Alright. I say hit and run Mortal Blade tactic is going to be the only way I can make this actually even somewhat work. One. Ah. Thanks. And... Oh, please. Okay. Ah. Thanks. Go ahead. Break my posture. Thanks. Cool. And... Slam down on you. Oh, my goodness. Okay, dodge. Okay, thanks. Uh, that. Mickey is interesting conceptually, but I'm. Uh, okay. Thanks. And. Thanks. Thanks. Dodge. And. Cool. Now we can. Slam. Slam. Oh, no. We can only go for one. Ever, really. Okay, cool. And. Alright. Cool. Hmm. Doing okay for ourselves, but... Five. One. Two. But I... Thanks. And... What if I... Thanks, 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 and... Thanks. And... Nice. And... One slash. Nice, nice. Okay, cool. This is good. Can, thanks. And... Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, please. The fact that he has a gun is so funny. But... Okay, so this is definitely how we need to do this, but I... Oh, never mind. I missed my first chance. Okay, cool. Hi. Nice. Cool. Ah, nice. It's just immediately lightning reversal on that phase, which I really need to be cognizant of. One, two, thanks. So bid the Mickey D and go for it. One, two, and thank you. We will thanks and slam, slam, and that actually is enough startup that we can get that going. Hi. Uh, huh. One. Go for a big attack that we can actually dodge. Okay, cool. And then we can slam, slam, and Jump it! Oh, never. Ah, that's really stupid of me. Okay. Thanks. Thanks. And. Right. Cool. One, two, and. One, two, alright, and. Ah, uh, never mind. Wait, what? I. Cannot afford to let this be the end. This could be it. This could be sweet. If it is, and even if it isn't. Cannot afford to do anything other than uh, one and cool. Thanks. Luckily, as long as we can block reliably, we can with most of this. Divine grass has to be known. Jump it. Oh, never mind. Okay. Cool. I let's try using this. Thanks. Dodge. Thanks. Dodge. Okay. And oh my. How did I block that Mikuri? That was actually really funny. 
And, okay, and, oh, never mind. I, oh, it was really badly used. Thanks, and one, two, and, can we hit? Nice. One, two, and one. Dodge, oh, nice. And then we can chunk. Nice dodge. Come on, just go for something. Go for something. Go for... Uh -huh. We slowly but surely take you down. Well, thanks. And one. Oh, never mind, never mind. Okay. I could dodge, dodge, dodge. Uh, please. I'm running out of every little bit of defense I've got, but I can... Come on. Thanks. Thanks. Uh. Jump it. Oh, but one, two. Ah, oh, never. What? It's a. Ah. Uh, if I don't intercept, I can't do anything. One, two, three, four. Thanks. And. Thanks. And. Thanks. Ah, uh, but. Need an attack, I can. Nikki D. One, two. What in the. What? How am I even supposed to. I can't do anything here. Uh, I'm, I've lost already. Okay. This just kills me. Cool. Uh, the big thing is just... I might need to specifically make use of... Bite Down. So what Bite Down does is you... You respawn with more HP when you resurrect, which could be useful. We are really running out of spirit elements now. Okay. Using the resurrection moons that I have for every little bit of survivability just leaving nothing nothing behind just gotta remember to have Ichimonji double up huh. this is my proving grounds if I can do this I can do maybe not everything but a great number of things one two one two and jump Slam, slam. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And thanks. And die. Cool. Okay. Alright. Cool. Not a sick at all. Use that Akko sugar. Akko spirit fall, I mean. Okay. One. One. Two. And, uh, oh, I can, never mind, okay, did not hit, one, two, and, can I, nice, and, cool, slam, slam again, and take you down, and just, thanks, cool, thank you, Ishin, thanks, and, nice, cool, one, and, just, cool, and, cool, slam, slam, and, one, two, three, ah, never mind, okay, cool, and, ah, oh, never, okay, cool, one, two, one, and just, thanks, and, cool, it's not the kind of thing that I actually need to, can really afford to try to get in on, thanks, and, well, never mind, I, one, two, here we are, cool, Okay, so there we go. Let's search stuff out. Thanks, and... Oh my goodness. Okay, you're gonna switch to somehow, so... We have a decent amount to use on this, so... Thanks. Oh, well, never... Okay, so I figured that would hit me, but I figured I'd... A bit more negotiating space, which was wrong. Thanks. Cool. Can I sling? And one, two, two... And can I... Oh, never, never mind. One, two, and... Oh, goodness, okay. Huge amount of posture damage from... Mortal Draw is... Pretty 
useful a lot of the time, but... Uh-huh. Can I... One. Okay. Just... Hmm. One. Gotta take you down, but also you're... Ah, never mind. One, two, three. Thanks. Go for the Mickey. And can we sink that down? One, two, three. Thanks. Cool. And just take that again. And just one, two, and okay. The thing is, is that he's definitely a bit more predictable when you one, two, and all right. He's definitely a bit more predictable when you stay close. More annoying if you stay away. One, two, three, four, and just jump and cool. Let's charge that up and cool, 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 and dodge and nickety and just one and two, three, and can we? Thanks. Oh, never mind. Okay. I one. Can I? Uh, interesting. I one and come on, just one. Excuse me. Oh, never. What? Okay. Oh, oh. There we go. That's pretty good. Okay, and just thanks. Check you out. Wait, did you really? He had the high ground and my. Wow, that was really funny, honestly. One. What? Huh? Okay. Weird. Okay, interesting. Nice. I need to face him. The emphasis on, you know, that's why it says face me second all. We don't face him, we'll die. Okay. Jump and two and can we nice. Chunk a bit of health. One and thanks. Cool. Go up and cool. One, two. Ah, oh, please. Need to peel. And dodge. There's something like a naked counter that I can. One, two, three, and thanks. And can I? Oh, well, never mind. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Ah. Jump and thank you. Wait, what? What in the? Oh, you have to jump towards him, otherwise it won't work. Oh wow, that's actually pretty cool. Well, this is the only healing we've got right now. I. Actually, in a position where I'm starting to run out, which is really, really not good. Okay, and just thanks. Cool. Let's go for a Mickey that I could. Thanks. Cool, and just. Oh, but I never mind. I thought that the Commodore would make a bigger difference than it actually did, but I. I. Uh, one, two. Hi. Uh, one, two, and can we thanks? Dodge and one, two, thanks. Let's just drain my posture back. You are a lunatic. Thanks. But I I'm not gonna be able to use spirit elements for anything unless I grind them, which is stupid. Can I swing? And one, and thank you. Well, one, two, and I wouldn't have the time to get a mortal draw off like that. So I, thanks, thanks, and jump. Okay, cool. Jump it, mortal draw, and cool. Jump it. Wait, what in the hell? <sighs> so stupid. The fact that you have to grind spirit emblems in this game is probably the worst thing about it. Because it's... The game is not balanced around not using spirit emblems. But if you don't... But if you use them and... It really is just punishment. Uh, well... One, two, three... One... Thanks, thanks. And you're gonna run in, or you're gonna. Well, whatever. Okay. One, one, 
And just thanks. Cool, can we slam that down on you? Cool. It's taking a bit longer, but one, two, one. No. Uh, one, two, thanks. And cool. Nice, cool. Slam that down and one. Two, three, jump, jump. Okay, nice. Bit of spamming, but it works. Okay. All right. One, one, two. Well, it. In the end, we can definitely do this even without. One, two. Just thanks. Without sugars, even without air bombs. One, two. Probably gonna have to. If it feels like this, so. Okay, cool. Nice, and cool. Slam that down again. One, two, three. Ah, god damn. So my timing was just off, and it... Again, there's a penalty for spamming, quote-unquote, that makes it so that the Fleckman gets smaller and smaller, and it just... The attacks come so quick that... Basically, you miss one, and the others become almost impossible to get as a result. Uh, well, the big thing is, is that I'm learning him a lot better. The annoying thing is just, again, that... One, I'm basically out of spirit emblems. Two, unless I'm comically close to him in the other phase, the lightning reversals will not hit. That said, if I use something like Mist Raven, actually, it would work very, very well. Because I'd be a lot higher, and I think that would guarantee... Not guarantee, but make a hit more likely, but... Whatever. Cool. Cool. One, two, one. Wait. Oh, I can... One, two, jump. Nice, okay. One, two... So Fast thruster is not something he usually does. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. And cool. Nice. And slam, slam. And one, two, and just one, two. And that down on you. Well, one, two, and up. Uh, well, whatever. Die. Okay, cool. Hmm. What a fine. Out of pellets, I literally only have gourds. Guess I don't know ceremonial tajo if I found like using, but I definitely do not. Uh, one, 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 two, and oh, that's right, you'll do that. And, okay. All right then, and slam and down. One, two, and what are you gonna do? One, two. Slam, slam. One, and... Slam that down. The rock in the way is... Cannot be anything good, but... Cannot... Nice, nice, nice. Oh my goodness. I, okay. Cool. Okay. Huh. Just... The fact that... All that posture damage was totally undone is... Thanks. And just because I can't hardly chunk anything through it. It's a pure duel of swordsmanship. And nice, and one, two, I was expecting wind, not that, but thanks, and can I, thanks, cool. And nice, and just thanks, cool, and one, two, one, two. Three, and just, can I, slam, slam, you just gotta, hesitation is defeat, and one, two, one, two, thank you, cool, right then, that means, again, it's just, it's gonna have to be mortal draws, though, I, okay, and we can take you out with, Decent hit, but I one, two, and oh well, nice. And then we can we swing, and ah, uh, it's not one we can actually punish reliably, which is 
very, very annoying, but I... I, mm, one, two, dodge, and cool. Let's just... One, two, and... One, two, three. One, two, three, and... All right. Cool, and can we... This is actually punishable, like this, because you don't have the deflection that you did before, but... Huh. I... What if we... Cool. Can dodge out of the way of that, which was very, very stylish. And we... Ah. Uh, thanks. And just... Slim and... Oh, never mind. Okay, cool. Huh. It's so funny that you actually end up using cover. Some kind of shooter. Uh, and cool. Nice and thanks. And we can swing and dodge. Thanks, I need to deflect. Thanks. And alright. And we can immediately more draw. And cool. Nice. Dodge. And thank oh never mind. Okay. Just thanks. Nice. Alright. So immediately face start heal. Thanks and take you out, but ah uh, well never mind. I planning is not actually something I can guarantee I can just do oh please and I can Well I messed up the weapon art use. Thanks and I, thanks, thanks, face through again, and cool, thanks, the window is pretty good for that, but, on just one, two, thanks, and just immediately swing, and one, two, and just, alright, two, and can we swing, and one, two, and heal, probably. Thanks, and oh goodness. Jump and. Well, never mind. Uh, okay. Uh, nice. Cool, and just swing. And load immediately. Okay, one, two. Thanks. Alright, and just immediately. Take that, and one, two. Uh. One, two, three, and cool. And. Thanks. And can we spin? Nice. Thanks. Get a single mortal draw in if you use that right. But I was just on a single. But I. Ah. Come on. Jump it. Okay, nice. And. Oh, there we go. Big hit. Big damage. Okay. Ah. But now you're. Ah, now you're. Half. I. Okay. Thanks. And I can. Ah. The posture down slow but sure we got one lightning off, which is really, really important. Thanks, and nice. This could be it. This should be it. And spin. Oh, lightning! Lightning! Is that die? Oh. Oh. Is he gonna get back up or what's gonna happen? He is. No, seriously, what happens if you just let him be? Let his posture go all the way back down. I attack him over here. Nothing happens. Sit and enjoy the thunder. The big thing is that, as you see right now, he's kneeling for execution. But what you might not... What I guess the average person might not know is that his posture bar is going back down. So the question is... And it would be truly stupid. What happens if his posture bar goes all the way back down? Is there some sort of voice line that nobody has ever seen before? It was really clutch to go in with. One last lightning reversal to chunk him down, but... The fact that you can take the high ground is annoying. I really should have used Mist Raven for it. Probably would have let me hit better. 
Because you go higher than a normal job. It's storming. Yeah, but like I said, he is... This is basically how, how a nobleman would kneel for Seppuku. Okay. Once that posture part fully regenerates... It really was. We're gonna let this one sit. Honestly, this might be a bit of an, ind an indignity for poor Ishin. For Ashina Ishin, but... The Japanese, his title in Japanese in this boss fight is Kinsei Ashina Ishin, which just means Sword Saint Ashina Ishin. I think I've mentioned it before, but I do find it interesting how they do have the first and last names basically in English name order. It's funky. It, Chunky has held down with the Mortal Blade and the Lightning Deflex was crucial. So the only reason I was able to do anything in this fight. So what will he do? What will he do now? Okay, so the posture bar goes away entirely, and it won't build back up, but he'll never get back up. Fushigiri. Yare! Saraba. Fushigiri. So that's the final boss of Sekiro. Every Saint Ishin devoted himself to deadly conflict in pursuit of strength. Single mad killing machine of a man. Seriously, and there we got Dragon Flash. Trade Blade always moved first. Gauntlet of Strength! Oh, nice. Your ends of conflict may afford a new state of mind. Alright. Divine Air Path has been unlocked. Severance Path. Kneel before Divine Air. So the question is. I literally missed the opportunity to share drinks with Emma before. But the nice thing is, I can just leave now. Also, I might actually, before we actually get the ending, maybe. Got a lot of strength in that you previously defeated in a series of battles. Extraordinary foes. So, what if I go to. Kodo's room? So now that uh, Ichin got brought back, I wonder what Emma will say. Because presumably Ichin's corpse over here should not be here anymore. This is... No! Ichin's corpse is still here! An entirely new body. Later Lord Kuro gives drink, not time for libations. I... Chief's humanity. So before any of that actually, just in case... Maybe I should show this off. Divine Air and Severance. Well, this one gives you something special. To reality, not tied to strength. And we're a lot stronger than we were when we fought these bosses originally. The others are a bit harder. So this is a little boss from the rematch gauntlet. And it gives you one of the best combat arts in the game. Also a memory, I believe. So. Oh, but I, I don't have any. Oh, that's insane. I don't have any spirit emblems here. Let's see how we can do this with no spirit emblems. If we can. What? Now past the castle gate. Sendai. Okay, this should be fine even without the stuff I have. Shinashu and. The Ashino and they took this country. Cool, cool. Thanks, thanks, and nice, nice, nice. Cool. One, two, three. Okay. Nice, cool. And take you down. And nine. Ooh, okay. But we have a lot more strength than we originally would have when we did this fight. But 14, and when we did this fight originally, we were at literally no bonus attack and strength. So we're about four times more damaging than we were. Which is pretty meaningful, I would say. But, mm, cool. Nice. Okay. Oh, but... Oh, that's actually good. We can spam some mortal blade hits. Thanks. Cool. Nice. 
And oh, I, okay. Interesting. Cool. Can we? One, two. Can we? One. That's what I should be doing. Just spamming mortal blade hits. It's. Yeah. Boss well, matches are cool. One, two, three. Nice. Dodge. And that's one. Thank you. That sound is, I believe, a cupboard I uh, Which is a whistling signal arrow. One, two, three. And thanks. Oh, oh, can we not? I don't think you can Mikiri that. Maybe not. You know, Mikiriing somebody on a horse seems to be maybe a bit beyond my capabilities. Thanks. Two, three. And can we. One, two, can we, another one, one, mm. mortal blade's good, but not, mm. did not have the opportunity we needed, but, oh my, oh, okay, so normally I guess that would just be death, for certain, thanks, I guess the question is, are gourds gonna be replenished in this fight at all, thanks, all right, Cool. Thanks. 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 Oh. Okay. Can I? Cool and nice. Not. Okay. Two and can we? Can we? Slam. Slam. Oh. Right. Hmm. I presumably should be able to do this pretty carefully if, but only if, frankly, I get all of my uh, gourds back every version of the fight, basically. Mm -hmm. Nice, and cool. Nice, and one, two, can I? Thanks, and slam. Okay, cool. Ah. This is good, but uh, we missed our opportunity. Uh, can I? Thanks. Oh, nice. Thanks. Cool. Mm -hmm. Still does seem a little harder than it initially was. Just a little bit. And cool. Can't see the guy. That's a thing. Oh my goodness. Okay. Alright. Still standing. And oh my goodness. Okay, and many times it takes. Thanks. Thank you. And we'll see how this ends up working. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks, and can we, one, two, can we, another one, one, ah, uh, so three is the most I can really hit with, but, thanks, yeah, it, it's the FromSoft special, finding the camera as the real enemy in the game, one, and there we are, cool, nice, go cool, man, but Yobu used to be, a bandit. That's his old backstory. Okay. Cool. Alright. On to the next. Okay. Oh, do we have to... Oh, I think we have to go to the Sculptor's Idol here. Well, you know, the horse was defending its master. I think that deserves some respect. Rest, place of reflection. Purchase spirit emblems, but I can't. It's a little sad, don't you think? Lady Butterfly, cool. But oh, but doing this without any any shuriken and also without the ability. To, oh, we don't have any snap seeds. Shoulder, no, nani. Two. And, thanks. Nice. And oh wait, grab attack. Never mind. Okay, cool. I'm uh, not having any albums for this is definitely different than what I expected. Oh, oh you did miss this fight. That's right. Now, she is... Well, she's an old woman. It's her whole deal. And... Which is cool. I do appreciate that they have you know, an older lady character who is also just actually really, really troublesome. But she's an illusionist who is hired by Owl to train us and then you know, kill us. 
Yeah, phantom butterfly. Phantom butterfly. Cool. Thanks, thanks, and one, two, and all right. Go ahead and cool. Thanks. One, two. Oh my goodness. If that didn't connect, that's what happens when you have no spirit emblems. Cool. Almost, yeah. But, well, the big thing is that... Oh, and she's using... She's basically using her own Owl's Flight step counter. Interesting. Okay. Oh, uh, but you're... Uh, okay, nice. Oh, uh, come on. Can I... Can I... <clears throat> what? Ooh, alright. And... Very tough sweep attack. One, two, and oh, never mind. Okay, cool, cool. One, two, ah, please. Okay. The big thing is that I need more for this, for sure. And oh my goodness. Okay. If I had more spirit emblems, this would be fine. Oh yeah, she is. Very cool. She's a personal favorite of mine, too, like I said, just because they have an actual, you know, old woman character who isn't a joke and who has some narrative importance. One, two. One, two, three. One, one, two. Oh, my goodness. Okay. I... Frankly, I should go and get some more spirit emblems and come back. <laughs> sure that this... The big thing is that it's not going to force me into an ending. When I talk to Kuro, I'll be okay. I can do this gauntlet after actually getting the ending and we'll be fine. Here we are. Let me see something. Oh, and I have to start all over again if I quit out. They treat that as death, too. Well, I... I'll try that again at least once. I need to get a few spirit emblems first. And yeah. Okay. Interesting. <clears throat> well, beating Ishin without any spirit emblems was kind of crazy. The big thing is, we've got our Frozen Tears, which is pretty good. More than enough Divine Grass. I don't use that stuff. Presumably, Ishin is going to be over here, too, but we can at least let well, the credits roll. Okay. Hmm. And Izzy... It seems that his body has disappeared. Fair enough. Okay, fair. Doko? Can't see. Doko ja? Dokami? Oh. So, we can give the tears for Immortal Severance, the tears in the Ever Blossom for Purification, which kills me. This one kills Kuro, this one kills me, this kills neither of us. I'm gonna do this one because it's probably the best. It's also listed last, so it's probably the best. Okay, cool. I'm sorry to hear you dislike your guests. I hope watching the best ending of Seiko that was more enjoyable. Osoba ni imas? Yeah, I'm at your side. Hmm? Oh? Ryu no Nabira? Dragon's Tears? Good, good. That's good. Aww. A little scuffed up, too. Poor Kuro. Oh. Hmm. And then... Oh. Oh. Oh, but right, if they were mixed together, they would be the frozen tears. Leave this place. Hmm. Oh, and there we go. This is going to be funky. You won't expect what comes next. Oh, 
Something similar happens in Kingdom Hearts. Okay. Oh. Back to Senpo. Hello there. That's... What is that? Sayonara. Oh, the... Divine Shell. Sayonara. Goodbye, everyone. Can't stay, basically. Oh, and she's dressed like a, like a bikuni, a Buddhist nun. Uh-huh. Sworn to serve his lord. Hi. Hi. Ryu no Shinobi. Ah, Shinobu. Shinobi of the Dragon. Rakonde Oremas. Is okay too. Time for a journey. Journey to the West. Kaminari Ryu. Basically. Basically. But she's carrying a Shaku. A religious staff. Dragon's Homecoming attained the return ending. We don't have to immediately start New Game Plus, so I'm gonna send another try at the Gauntlet of Strength. There we go. Cool. That took every last... It was! It was. It's the ending where nobody has to die. It's the Undertale pacifist ending. That, you know, I thought it would have taken either longer or shorter. But I do think that makes Sword and Ishin the FromSoft boss that has taken me the longest. Maybe. Well, the longest once I knew what I was doing, because the big thing with Orphan of Chaos is that once I figured out how to cheese it by dodging underneath it, the Kodenji Temple. Oh, a theological advisor and a historical advisor. Oh, wow, they had theological advisor for this. That's crazy. It's really cool, actually. I like that a lot. Mm -hmm. What is interesting is that, at this point in Japanese history, if I recall correctly, there was not a meaningful separation between Shinto and Buddhism. There was one, more or less, in force. Near the end of the 19th century, for partially political reasons, but... Shani-san. Will that be Odin of the Waters music? Maybe. Pony Canyon. Harmonics. Thank you all. Namikawa Daisuke Ito Shizuka. Suda Kenjiro. Well, the big thing is, like I said, both Emma and Sekiro are fate characters. Their Japanese voice actors play fate characters who are also. Well, to the extent that Emma is sort of Sekiro's teacher in a way, the exact opposite is true of their characters in Fate, which is funny. But whatever. If you got into Fate, I'd never be able to forgive myself. Please don't. But, a lot of other interesting characters. Well, just that the Japanese voice actors play characters who are also, you know, also interact with each other regularly in Fate, and that. Oh, that. If you got into Fate, I would never be able to forgive myself. 
That said, I probably will be playing a Fate game later this fall. This is the final... Yeah, I figured. Like I said, it is... an incredibly male-targeted franchise. It's a good game. It's another action RPG where you'll get to see me die a lot, so... Also, also... Also, there's Yaoi. Also, there's Yaoi in it. Well... Like I said, you know... Like I've said before, I respect them for it, but I do feel kind of bad for them in the sense of... It is a series that has very little interest in throwing them a bone, even occasionally, so to speak. Spec Ops. But, like I said, this fall I should probably be playing through Fate Samurai Remnant, which is also... also a Japanese historical fantasy game, generally. But... Well, yeah, I do too. I like it for the plot. Because the character writing is really, really, really good. It's made me cry many, many times. But... That there are enough people who are in there for other reasons. And those other regions are kind of disproportionately targeted. Well, it... Yeah, but I think... There aren't a lot of... Even though, you know, it's the target demographic is quote-unquote shonen, there aren't a lot these days that don't at least try to have some sort of crossover appeal. I mean, just... The second installment of Chainsaw Man that's been coming out for the past year and a half or so arguably has a female main character that is, you know... It's from her perspective just as much as the previous male main character and apparently he's very the, the author he is very good at writing women and portraying a relatable female perspective oh right Kenichiro Ashina in the English is Ray Chase yeah the voice actor for Genichiro in English is the same voice actor as English Nuviat too. <laughs> okay. Just see. Let's see. And oh, large sculptor's idol in the dilapidated temple. The large sculptor's idol. Hmm. See. Well, I am not going to start playthrough two number now. It is what it is. I think a lot of it is just another's memory. Ash oh, we got another costume. Sir Ashina, dead of gratitude, took his arm and graced it with name Sekiro. Memories of another, Ultra's form, no bearing on ability. Charge of another's regret is but a fleeting thing after all. Change form. Let's use this. Returns from the great beyond does so at the peak of their prosperity. You have to strengthen all manner of techniques. Regret his mortal struggle. Wish for war until his final hour. That is precisely what he got. Well, I guess the big thing is... I'm gonna try that boss gauntlet. It needs some emblems first, but we'll wait. Gotta sell some things, but let's see what I can even afford to sell. Can I afford to sell? How many lumps of fat wax do I need? Well, I gotta fight Gyobu again, actually. That's the thing. The large. Oh, is in. It's not one. It looks a bit different now, too. How much fat wax do I still need for the remaining upgrades? That's... We need... We can sell 15 lumps. 
Okay. Cool. If I wanted to, I could try killing things through emblems, but... Uh, actually, that probably would be a better way to do it. I'm gonna go back to Mibu real quick. Actually, first, I'm gonna go to the castle and see if... Now that we've done that ending, I wonder if Ishin's corpse is still gonna be here. Because if so, what it tells me is... I need to give Emma the drinks much earlier. Wait, what? What happened? What did I do? Yeah, I miss all of my opportunities to give Emma drinks. Wait, what happened? Why are you laughing? I'm afraid. Are you are you are you alive? Are you are you okay? Are you still here? Oh, okay, okay. Sorry. Well, if we go back here, we can. Let's see. This shouldn't be the best spot to farm. Oh. Well, I was afraid for a second. Okay, cool. Big thing is, we're gonna pop a couple of balloons, go down to a spot where these guys spawn infinitely, and yeah. Water mill's over here, but should be fine. Okay, cool. Thanks. All right. Thanks. And oh my. Okay. Oh my goodness. You gotta be kidding me. This guy kills me. I swear. Okay. Well, we got some of that, but one, two. Nice. It. It's not impossible. Okay. Oh, it pacifying agent. Find a spot where I can farm these. Guys, independently, just for spirit was in a bit of cash. Fair. As long as it's, as long as you're okay with it. So over here, I believe, is a spot where I spawn infinitely. Yeah, I think, oh my goodness. You're kidding me. You're kidding. Okay, I, let's just use the soul and money balloons. I mean, the spirit and... The wealth balloon is just to kill these guys. They're gonna stay over here. We're fine. Nice. Okay, cool. Thanks. Cool. Should come back. Gotta get some albums. Okay, they should actually be coming out over here, I believe. Yeah, okay. Cool. Alright. Cool. Come on, keep crawling. Keep crawling. Oh, but I. Uh, don't want the backstab, actually, though. That's the thing. And, okay. Alright. Let's just... Thanks, thanks. Die. Give me spirit emblems. I'm begging you. Okay. Alright. 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 So I got all these. I can do the fight I want to do. And we get a bit of money for free ceramic shards. What are they? Oh, they're actually not infinite. This show up a whole heck of a lot of times. That's not what I expected, actually. Okay. Cool, I guess. Huh. All right. By the way, we have a bunch of these and really nothing else to do with them. Okay. Let's go kill this guy. Yeah, just depleting all of my emblems. It's crazy. Well, for better or worse, I have now learned every relevant fight in the game. And how to do them. Not to say they're easy, but... Okay. So we got all the emblems we need. We'll be fine. Thanks. Thanks. Uh, that's cool. Nice. Kill the Tato guy. Kill the other guy and hope that... Okay, we got everything we needed, actually. Shove enough for a snap seat, basically, which... Presumably... Big thing is, I've got enough to... Uh, go through the fights, presumably. Hmm. 
story to full after each, but... Uh, the big thing is I'm pretty sure that the emblems I have is are going to take me through. And that I know that most consumables get restored to you. Question is... Hmm, let's see what happens. I should buy a snap seed for Lady Butterfly. Buy a... Snapsy. The big thing is just that I missed completely. Completely missed. Getting to drink with Emma. She talks about getting rescued by. I can just read that dialogue. I can do that. But actually, what I should do first is. She has some skills. And... Oh, but I can't get any of those. But devotion would be good. For Steed. The stuff in Temple Arts is actually pretty good, to compensate for the fact that it's literally... Actually, what I could do right now is just get blood. Do that. Cuts and scars, and physical toll, body, mind, your hearts, but yeah. You know, presumably the kanji I do means both mind and heart. Scars and blood. Then, of course, Beast Karma, but now we have... Let's rest real quick, and now our limit is slightly increased. Let's go do this Gauntlet of Strength and see how it works. Should be basically Lady Butterfly, Gilbu Butterfly, and then just Genichiro, and that should more or less be it, but we'll see. The big thing is, I should probably actually have Ichimonji double on here. Maybe. Must attack on the nutty and one, two, one, two, three, and cool. And alright. Thanks, two, thanks, and charge up. Oh well, that did not quite work. Never mind. This is already much, much better. Okay. Just all on the Thanks. And I think his name is basically Demonic Bay Horse, basically. And cool. One, two, three. Already going much, much better. Can we grapple on? One, two, three, four. And nice. 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 And one, two. Doesn't have a lot of posture regain, which is. Oh, but that. The buff worked. The debuff worked. But. Uh -huh. Okay, cool, and nice, let's turn it down, one, two, and just one, two, thank you. And that's our first health bar down, cool, thank you, and alright, one, two, oh, but I, well, whatever, more vitality and posture damage from the debuff is useful, but, thanks, thank you, one, two, Thanks, put that down, and this should be nice, cool, cool, one, two, three, four, uh, the distance where I can hopefully use, uh, you got too far away, one, uh, never mind, and, cool, jump, okay, cool, that would have been a sweep, which is aggravating, at least a little, thank you, and, I, okay, cool, but I, oh, how am I, how did I also, Take posture damage with that. Okay. One. Ah, nice. And it didn't show up quite immediately because you have to get pretty close. Go cool, in. Simple. Hmm. The big thing is that Inner Genichiro isn't horrible. Well, he's harder than normal Genichiro, but. First we should rest. Then that should presumably... Oh no, you actually use all of your... Oh, wow. So the question is, am I going to get my emblems replenished? Or are they just going to end up getting used? Do emblems get used up during... Emblems do get used up. Oh. Alright. That's news. Not good news. Okay. Cool. One, two. Oh, one, two. 
three. Do it. Slam. Down on two. I. Thanks. Nice. And. One, two. Two and. Oh, well. Ah, interesting. I should honestly be using the ceremonial Tonto for this. Mm -hmm, just a. Thanks. One, two. Send that down on you. And. One, two. And cool, nice, and put that down on your head, thanks. Two, three, and cool, nice, and big thing is we can just knock you down when you use your short again. And oh, but I ah, never mind. One, two, and just throw. Oh, but I ah, never mind. How am I supposed to do that? Oh, uh, okay. Can we slam and ah, what am I going to do? Thanks, and... Cool. Oh. Really? Thanks. Take you out. Shrug your posture down. At one, two. And... Cool. Nice. Send that down. Send that down again. And one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. And... Oh, I need to get the Tonto up. Thanks. Cool. And... Alright. Thanks. Two. Yeah, I cannot. One, two. This fight is much harder without actually being able to guarantee having spirit emblems. Oh, but I. One, two, three. And I, oh, okay. What? Okay. That was dangerous. It's just all the spirit emblems that I. The cost of them is kind of crazy, honestly. But whatever. I'll do it. One, two, three, four, and can we... Oh, nice! We can actually interrupt that charge with a shuriken, and can we... Nice, but I... Oh, never mind, okay. One, two... One, two... Three, four, five, six, and can we... Oh, but I... Never mind. One, two... And can I... Nice, I... Okay, cool. But I... Mm, interesting, okay. One, two, one, thank you, nice. Now just the, ah. Uh, Tonto working the way it does is not fun for me. Hmm. <sighs> well, lose yourself in my illusions. Cool, okay. Naraba, which means we use our Snapseed. Snapsy we got. Thank you. Aboroshi. And cool. Nice. Tando Sinde. Segare. One, two. Thanks. Oh, but I, mm, Maybe I should actually using. Still be using Empowered Immortal. That would probably be a good idea, but I. Thanks. Cool. Can I, ooh, but right user. Phantom stuff. Okay. One, two. Posture damage was very capable. One, two. They don't have a lot of great answers to that. One, two, and okay. Because uh, they're not really balanced around that much deal with getting mortal drawn on. And of course, you're really, really okay. Uh, Alright. Well, what if I take you out? Luckily, I can just kill you, but annoying. Summoning adds is definitely a way to do things. Pretty good strategy, probably. One, two, and... Ah, oh, goodness. Alright. And of course you're... Oh, but... Now they're all being turned into butterflies to pursue me. Fine. Alright, so... Oh, my... Okay. Ah, so that's what happens. And thanks, cool, and can we one, two, thanks, one, two, three, four, ah, one, ah, please, I, we, one, dodge, oh my, okay, cool, can I, that's not a, ah, please, it's embarrassing, thanks, and just one, or miss entirely, that's also an option, I guess, but I, oh, what in the, okay, cool, and, one, two, one, two, and one, two. It's 
Hit and run mortal blade tactics are going to be the only way I can do this, presumably. Thanks. Okay, cool. Nice. And, okay. One, two, or not. And more illusions. Great. I love you. You're my best friend. Okay. One, two, and can I... One, two, and... At least the mortal draws, actually. Taking a good number of them. Oh, guess you got a free spirit emblem. Me, okay. Cool. And, well, time to stay out of the way of you. It is so funny that this is actually kind of annoying. Entirely just because... I ran out of emblems when you should. I mean, it makes sense, but... Okay, die. Goodbye. See ya. Go in. Mm -hmm. okay, okay. okay, cool. Let's try inner Genichiro. Can't buy any emblems, huh? And but that would Ah, a new state of mind amidst memories of battle. Alright, cool. Okay. Inner Genichiro. Classic. This unlocks Sakura dance if you do it right. But I Oh my goodness. Thanks. One, two, three. Okay, cool. Thanks, thanks. Oh, I alright. Thanks. Nice. Nice. Ooh, I Oh, he's doing Mortal Blade stuff. I don't like that. Okay, cool. Nice, and... Huh. One, two, and... Oh, wow. This is tough. Okay, and just... One, two... And... Can I... One, one, two, and... Nice. Or not. Can I... Can I... One, two... One, jump it, okay, one, two, yeah. uh, attack was really, really, okay, and, oh, wow, thanks, Ni ooh, wow, okay, nice, thanks, thanks, and, we slam down on you, and, one, one, okay, nice, chasing slice on his bow attack is very tough, nice, ooh, all right, Thanks, and, ooh, alright, and, give me, no, oh, thanks, alright, heal, I, uh, thanks, ooh, I need to, you're something, okay, cool, what, a, what, never mind, okay, cool, I need to dodge, and, okay, oh, but it went through the, soccer dance went through block, that is tough, Okay, nice, and... Oh, what? Okay. Alright then. Shikara. Kill you as many times as it takes. Can I... Thanks, and... Oh, well, I... Oh, come on. That overhead was really, really irritating. And I... Ah, oh, what? Let's stay out of the way of his... Floating... Passage. And, and I, one, two, three. Okay, and it... Even through a perfect deflect, it deals very meaningful damage. I, okay. And I, oh, come on. Nice. And one, two. Ah, but I... Oh. Come on, come on, come on. And just roll in it. One, ah, never mind. Now this... Another time. Another time. On my own time. I... This is not... The big thing is legitimately just... I do not want to have to... Ah, god damn you! Just go away already! Running out of spirit emblems... Literally not having enough spirit emblems for the fights is... The fact that you can run out of spirit emblems at all is... Ridiculous. At least we got everything we had back, but it's just... Really? Really? I... Yeah, I don't care anymore. I'm done with this game. <laughs> Sandaragan, it's time for Demon Souls. Okay. You know, you beat Sword Saint Ishin. 
you know, it's, I don't, I don't care anymore. Cool. See you tomorrow, eventually. Thank you, I'm glad you liked it. Really tough game. Santa Ragan. <laughs>